Don't allow me to share your wheelchair. Oh, the uh, tablet? Yeah. A little while. I just had to figure out something. Settings, yeah. yeah. Settings, something. You on the um, NC, right? Yep. I'm on the honor code, yeah. I'll probably open up and let you. Uh -huh. With a 12 out, this motherfucker was good. You know what I'm talking about? Let's get it. Jigs, have you seen y'all preaching, man? Jay, it's bigger than that, man. It's bigger than just seeing us preach. You gonna listen to it? Or you gonna be out here just begging? Right. Take missiles drop, you know what I'm saying? Sooner or later, I think you gotta seek the Lord. You gotta seek the men of the Lord eventually. Gotcha. Except you seek him now, where everything's going good, or you try to seek him when all hell breaks loose and you don't mm -hmm. find him. Either way, you're gonna seek him. Especially going into like Amos, what is that? Um, eighth chapter, mm -hmm. verse 11, how that family in the word. Yep. You most definitely don't want to be trying to seek somebody doing that family in the word, yo. That shit gonna be crucial, man. Come uh, on, we good. Good? Uh, oh, I gotta get uh, on the go. You want on the go, right? Yeah. You got what, like four? Let me give me a water right quick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got that. Got the you know these shit, bro? Yeah. Shopper, you, you want some drink, bro? Water, right? Good? The water, the water. Oh, these shit's nice and good, Joe. These shit's cold as fuck. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Oh, the bunch of shit cold as fuck. My favorite suit. Coconut, baby. Lord, be taking care of us, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta hold your tears back, yo. How the Lord be just blessing, brothers, man. You know what I'm saying? On a regular, yo. Like, we ain't never been no selfish dudes. Nope. So brothers always looking out for each other, yo, every time. You know what I'm saying? Right. It's beautiful, yo. Because so like, if, if you do something new for me, you ain't waiting on me to do something for right. you. Ah. You're doing it because you want to, right. and vice versa. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's that's what the Lord's talking about, how you going to know who his men are. Because they're not going to be doing something for each other just to receive something back. You know what I'm saying? They're going to do it because they want to do it. That's the spirit that the Lord put in them. You know what I mean? Right. We're ready, bro. Got him. All right, all right, we the Hebrew Israelites. We come out here week in and week out to prophesy the downfall of America, a.k.a. Babylon the Great. We're saying that first and foremost, we want to give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son. Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rekakwadash. Next double honors to the head apostle slash elder bishop of Great Millstone, the one that taught us the 100% truth according to the Bible, peace, blessings, and safety to all you sincere occupants. Keep pushing, keep believing, keep their faith. Regardless of people here for a best, starting off with the head tribe, Judah, the so-called Negroes, Benjamin, Jamaicans, the West Indies, Levi, the so-called Haitians, Simeon, the so-called Dominicanos, Zebulon, the so-called Panamanians, Ephraim, the so-called Puerto Ricans, Manasseh, the so-called Cubanos, Gad, the North American Indian tribes, Reuben, the so-called Seminole Indian tribes, Naphtali, the indigenous people of Argentina to Chile, Asher, the Colombians, the Uruguay, the indigenous people. Last but goddamn certainly not least, Issachar, the so-called Mexicans. If you see yourself depicted on this sign, according to the seed of your father, repent and turn back, because America will be destroyed in your lifetime. And it's just true. It's just true. As the brother Naquan would say, it's just true. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What you want, bro? I got to open it for you. Yep, yep. The book of Jeremiah, chapter 28, verse. As a matter of fact, I get it for you, bro. Come, come. Don't you speak first, you know what I'm saying? Did you come. get it in? Yeah, we're living in some great times, man. You see what's going on over uh, in the so-called Middle East, which is, you know, uh, Elder Malcolm often goes into it, is Western Asia. Mm -hmm. But, uh, you know, with the small hats, basically uh, uh, provoking and instigating war against the Persians, so-called Iranians, which is all prophecy, because this is what's going to make Russia, God may God, you know, uh, uh, come out of the woodwork, so to speak. So everything's being fulfilled in these last days that he saw his wicked kingdom. This is Jeremiah chapter 28, verse 8, and it reads, The prophets that have been before me and before thee of old prophesied. 
both against many countries yep. and against great kingdoms. And it's always been that way. Whenever the Lord raised up prophets, a kingdom is about to go down, that kingdom that's ruling. So we're living in a time of Esau, the so-called white man's rulership is about to go down right before our eyes. So guess what? The prophets are out here. This is a sign in itself. We, talk, we, we saw the solar eclipse, one of the signs of the end times. But the prophets are also a sign, mm -hmm. okay? That America is about to be destroyed, which is the main hub of the Edomites, the so-called white people. That's right. So we're prophesying against this place, letting you know to seek the kingdom before the Lord comes back. You Israelites. And it says nearer than what we believe. Yep. So deletion, destruction, chaos, mayhem, the end of sleazy East rulership, it's nearer than what we believe. Right. And that was written thousands of years ago, bro. Yep. So how much closer are we now? Yep. You know we're close now, man. Shit is popping up. You know, so you got um small hats threatening um Iran, yep. yeah. Shit that we're hearing now. Yep. We only thing we need to do is just stay focused, yo. Yep. Stay the path, yo. Stay the path. Don't let nothing discourage you, you know what I'm saying, of, of staying on the mission. You know what I'm saying? Right. There's gonna be a whole lot of distractions, you know what I'm saying, to get you off the mission. Stay mm -hmm. on the mission. Stay focused, right? Mm -hmm. Second Ezra chapter six, verse nine, and the reason I'm gonna come right back. Yep. Second Ezra chapter six, verse nine, and the reads, for Esau is the end of the world. Yep. And Jacob is the beginning of it that follow. Yep, yep, you made a good point about if I may say the movie Matrix. When uh, uh, I think Neo was showing, uh, forget his name, about the, you know, you had the different people in the street, and, and he was distracted by the woman in the red dress. Oh yeah, um, uh, what's his name? Merkless. I no. forget his name. Uh, yeah, uh, Neo. Yeah, Neo. Neo. What was the dude? Nah, name? I the dude's uh, name. Morpheus. Morpheus. Yeah, Morpheus. Morpheus. Yeah. Yeah. That that woman in the red dress is the, is the world. Right. You yeah. Know? America. Don't be carving the ways of America. Right. Man, you can right. read that again, Bible. The second Ezra chapter six. Verse 9, in regards of people here for a bet, we come out here week in and week out. It don't even matter. Yo, we know, no, see, the Lord already told us, yo, when you go out there, ain't nobody going to listen to you. Right. Don't give a damn about that. Because if you focus on people, listen to you, trying to grab everybody. You know you're Israelite. Man, 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 man. Say, sir, nah, sir. Know, come right. on, man. You're going to waste all your time just saying, man, sir. <laughs> Bring out these scriptures in regards that they're here for a bet. Because whoever is meant for them to get, to get yep. it, they're going to get it, right? Fact. Second Ezra chapter 6, verse 9, and it reads, for Esau uh -huh. is the end of the world. Yeah, Esau is a progenitor of the Edomites, so-called white people. Mm -hmm. This is the end of his age, his rulership. It's going down. Right. Now, as wicked as it has been, we, this is the most wicked we ever seen on the face of the earth. Mm -hmm. did, you, did you not think it's going to be a dramatic uh, takeout? Right. The Lord's going to match the energy of this place, man, with the That's destruction right. that he's getting ready to bring. Boom, 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 right. boom, 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 boom. That's all you're going to hear, y'all. And if you hear that, you're done anyway, man. You see? If you hear that right there, you're done, you know what I'm saying? Because Lord William, we're here, you know what I'm saying? Um, come here, come and enter down to the chambers, you know what I'm saying? That Isaiah 26, I think it's 21, 22, either 20, 21. Mm -hmm. Lord William, we're here that. That's right. Come enter down to thy chambers, you know what I'm saying? We either come up hither, you know what I'm saying? Until the indignation be a little past. Hey, talk about you can turn that around just a little bit, like make it go like that right there, kind of like this way? The other way. This way, yeah. A little bit more wrong. Yeah, 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 yeah. It says, um, that, that's, that's good, yeah. yeah. Second Ezra chapter 6, verse 9, and it reads, For Esau is the end of the world. Yep. And Jacob is the beginning of it that followeth. Yeah, hey, Jacob, which represents the Israelites. You know, the kingdom, come. Uh, you can give me uh, Daniel, the seventh chapter. This is the kingdom that the, the Heavenly Father promised to the only begotten Son. Yahweh promised to Yahweh Shai. Daniel, right? the seventh chapter? I think it's Daniel, the seventh chapter. Can I bring up this quick precept? Because uh, yep, yep. um, our people heard that um, he's the end of the world. Yeah, we heard that um, he, he's the end of the world, right? Yep. This is the world, the earth. The earth is going to blow up. Run, <laughs> run. You know what I'm saying? It means the end of an age, and I got it right quick. Yeah, it's yep. proving that the earth is going to be around forever. Mm -hmm. This is Ecclesiastes chapter 1, verse 9, and it reads, The thing that have been is that which shall be done. Uh -huh. Um, no, that ain't the one. Um, four, right? Kind of the water, bro. Ecclesiastes 1 and 4, the water shop. One generation passeth away, and another generation cometh, but the earth abideth forever. You got it. So basically, when you when you hear us read 2nd Ezra 6 and 9, it says, Esau is the end of the world, mm -hmm. means the end of an age. Yep. Not the end of the world, not the end of the, the world. earth gonna blow up and all that other nonsense. Because our people, the earth is gonna go, it's about to blow up, man. Go run, run, run to Mars. You know what I'm saying? Run to Saturn. Let's go to the moon. No, man, you ain't gotta go to the moon. The earth is gonna be here and by forever, man, all right? Plus, this is um, pretty much headquarters. Yep. You know what I'm saying? The earth is yep. headquarters, aka Jerusalem, Israel. Yep. So I want to go. Um, I want to go get what you get. What you wanted. Daniel's right. The seventh chapter. Seven chapter. Because he said Esau is the beginning of it that followed. Oh, it's like here. Jacob is the beginning of it that followed. Right. Which are the Israelites. So the head of the kingdom is going to be Yahweh Shai, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus. Then you got King David, the twelve on down. That order is getting ready to be set up. 
prophecy is being fulfilled right before our eyes. Mm -hmm. Yo, the everlasting kingdom is about to be established, so the Lord is making it a dramatic effect, man. That's right. He's not just going to just hand the keys over. No, he's going to make the, the earth uh, remember his name again. Mm -hmm. And he's going to be known by his judgments. So the, the destruction of America, the Lord is preparing for this place, is a buildup of and the glory of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. It's all about mm -hmm. the Lord, man. We're basically um, declaring, you know what I'm saying, the second coming of our Lord yep. and Savior, Lord Yahweh Shai. You see? Yep. Um, uh, which verse? Oh, 13. 13. And then down to 14, Bible Kushai. Daniel chapter 7, verse 13, and it reads, and that's how I, I was going to start that too. God. I saw in the night visions, and behold, one like unto the Son of Man. Yahweh Shai. Came with the clouds of heaven. Yep. And it came, you know what I'm saying, my friend, let me get a precept. Just put uh, the clouds all right. Yep, yep. Those chariots. Yep, just get that right away. Mm -hmm. I'm not giving you. Uh, yep. I'm in the spirit right now. Yep. So I'm just gonna flow. This is Psalm chapter 104. Bear with me. Psalm chapter 104. This is the vision that uh, the vision that Daniel received. We read about in, in uh, Daniel, the book of Daniel, seventh chapter. The prophecy is about to be fulfilled, man. Mm -hmm. Psalm chapter 104, because I mentioned clouds. My people think it's the regular clouds. Right, you know right, right, right. Not knowing that the clouds are talking about this. Psalms 104. And three, who layeth the beams of his chambers in the waters? Who maketh the clouds his chariot? The clouds his chariot. So Yahweh shot was brought before Yahweh, the heavenly father. He came and he came with the clouds, meaning the chariots. Right. Right? In his vision that Daniel received. That's right. The water, brother. So go right back. Are you on the bar? Daniel chapter 7, verse 13 again, and it reads, I saw in the night visions, and behold, one like unto the Son of Man uh -huh. came with the clouds of heaven. The chariots and came to the ancient of days. Yeah, the ancient of days, a title of the heavenly father. It's one of the titles, right? Yahweh is his name. That's right. So Yahweh Shah was brought before Yahweh in this vision that Daniel received. Might have to lay it down, probably. I know, right? Yeah, that's so. a good idea, Khan. That went. Yeah, that thing cutting ain't it no matter where we go, right? Right. It's like it's using, I don't know, it's circular. Right, you know what I'm saying, bro? We, and it never really did before, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> So, so, so we, we know what time it is now. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. It says, um, it came to the ancient of days, and they brought him near before him. Uh -huh. And there was given him dominion. Dominion. Right? Keep going. You want me to get the definition? Oh, yeah, come, come. Yeah, yeah. do your thing. Yep. So this is, so that's why the scriptures say uh, the volume of the whole book. So you got to include the, the Old Testament and the New Testament. Mm -hmm. There are prophecies that, that are still playing out from the Old Testament. That's right. You know, Isaiah, Daniel, Jeremiah, a lot of these prophecies are still playing out. And then some to play out still when, even when the kingdom of heaven is established. That's right. It says um, sovereign, sovereignty. Uh, sovereignty. Sovereignty. Yep. Sovereignty, yep. yep. Or control. Mm -hmm. Control. So this is, this, the Lord is setting up a new rulership and dominion, which is promised to Yahweh Shai. Right. That's that Jacob uh, beginning forever, but we read about the second edges, uh, six and nine, six chapter, verse yep. nine. Yep. Right? This is, this is the, the, the promise the Lord gave to Yahweh Shai. Mm -hmm. The Heavenly Father gave to Yahweh Shai. Control over everything, over man. Over everything. So, um, supremacy. Yep. Um, do, um, dominance. Dominance mm -hmm. over our enemies, over these other nations. Yep. And the Lord... It was only a matter of time before the Lord is going to pluck this this last nation, this last um, rulership, right. you know, from their reign. Thus said the Lord, thus said the Bible. That's right. Did you think Israel would be down forever? Right. <laughs> the Lord promises, you know, everything was made for our sakes. Mm -hmm. And then, you know what I'm saying, going right back to Job, um, it's either 14 or either 20. The triumph of the wicked is short. Yep, sure. And the joy of the hypocrite for a moment. So, yeah, this man don't only had a moment to rule the earth. It ain't for all eternity. I know, right? The Israelites are going to rule for all eternity, man. Not a heathen, man. That don't even sound right know, anyway. Right? Think the Lord going to let a heathen right? rule the earth for all eternity. You know what I'm saying? Just going to destroy it. Right. Just take it, you know what I'm saying, down to the stone age. Right. Nah, man. Nah, man. It says, uh, look, look, rule, authority. You know what I'm saying? Influence. Uh -huh. so, so the influence coming from Lord Yahweh Shai, because says um, he's going to set one over that is profitable. Yeah. One uh, right back to our what is it? Sirach? Sirach, yep. Or I think second Ezra. Sirach, right? Sirach chapter 10, ain't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah he's going to put one over the earth that's profitable Prop to the earth. Yep. The earth is going to actually uh, prosper yep. upon the Lord Yahweh Shai's rule. You know right. what I'm saying? Because sure. it says when the wicked bear rule, the people mourn. Oh, yep. And when the righteous are, are in authority, the people rejoice. Right. So when Lord Yahweh Shai get back into power, yep. you know what I'm saying? And control. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Mother Earth, everyone's going to rejoice, especially the Israelites. Yep. You know what I'm saying? It's like men and women, made of the men. That's right. Because the men are going to rule the earth once again in righteousness, man. It is like men, yo. And Lord willing, with uh, of that first arm uh, fruits. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You see? 
And it's, it's only right that uh, the first fruits, you know what I'm saying, be allowed, you know what I'm saying, to govern the earth. Because they're the one they have created. You know what I'm saying, bro? Yeah, that's right. That's why that's why that's why we feel the way we feel. We see somebody fucking littering. Right. We know we can't do no the like. Right. <laughs> we, we, we see a brother throw something down, yo, bro, yo, pick that up, bro. Up, bro. You know what I'm saying? Pick that up. We see somebody throw the whip. That's why we get aggravated when the water gets polluted. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Uh, anything gets yep. polluted, man. The water, we see trees getting cut down, you know, so we feel some type of way, yep. man. You know what I'm saying? Yep. The animals are special, you know what I'm saying? Yep. We feel some type of way, man. Because Lord willing, we might be of that first fruit, man. Lord They'll Lord create man. everything with Lord Yahweh, Shai, the Elohim, you know? If you want to chime in, shop, you know what I'm saying? Feel free. Mm -hmm. It says I'm influenced. Yep. Um, leadership. Yep. True and leadership is being set up, and it's being set up in perfect order. Mm -hmm. You know, that's why you see all the different things being set up, people getting deleted, taken out. You know, uh, order is being aligned and la laid out amongst Israel, those that are hopeful elect. Right. True leadership is being set up. Order is getting is being set up. The Lord's kingdom is going to reign perfectly, man. Mm -hmm. The leadership is going to be in the right order. That's right. Oh, yeah, another definite is, is con um, conalized. Like how that oh, devil went around and conalized. I say it again. Uh, uh, when this devil went around and colonized, am I saying it right? Yeah, colonized the earth. Looks like he went colonized. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Colonized. That's, colonized. What Lord, that's what the Lord, that's what Lord Yahweh is going right. to do. But he's going to do it in righteousness, though. Right. This devil went out and then colonized. Yep. Colonized. <laughs> <laughs> Give me the tongue colonized. twisters, though. You know what I'm saying? Colonized. 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 Them, yep. them tongue twisters. You know what I'm saying? Certain words yep. that we all the same. But it's the best of tongue anyway. You know what I'm saying? Right. We're going right. back to that Lysha Wine called Dasha. You know what I'm saying? Foreign Hebrew. You know what I'm saying? So this best of tongue, we're not going to speak it no more. You know what I'm saying? Right. So tomato, tomato. Right. Fuck it. You know what I'm right. saying? It don't even matter, yo. <laughs> the Lord will come back and establish the earth and righteousness. Put it That's like right. that, yo. They're going to go throughout the four corners of the earth and do it, yo. That's right. But not here in the Babylon because this place is going to be destroyed. So going right back to Daniel. Daniel chapter 7, verse 14. And this is the gospel. That's right. This is the good news. This is what we out here proclaiming. Yo. This is the good news. America's going to be destroyed. Lord mm -hmm. Yahweh is coming back, you know what I'm saying, to um, colonize the earth mm -hmm. in righteousness. You know what I'm saying? Oh, and he's going to have his men with him. Yep. Like, yo, you go do this. You go do that. that. Look, yep. You group of men, go do that. Yep. And look, look. Yes, yes, sire. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. going to speed up <laughs> yes. like fucking Superman type shit, yep. bro. You know what I'm saying? The speed of, uh, speed of sound, bro, is taking yeah. off, yo. Lord, when we have that number, man. Yeah. It says, it says um, the spirits rejoice when they're commanded, like, um, what is it, um, Sirach 39, oh, 39, the spirits yep. made of revenge. Yep. At the bottom it says they rejoice, you know what I'm saying, at his command, yep. when the Lord sent them forth to do certain things for them, they rejoice, how much more on the righteous side, you know what I'm right. saying? It's an honor to be out here, man, we're rejoicing right about now. Right. Lord got us out here doing this beautiful work, the Lord don't give a damn, nobody don't listen, this is ain't for everybody, man. Right. We're rejoicing right about now, it's an honor just to be, you know what I'm saying, like called to even teach this blessed mm -hmm. word, bro. Lord, what are we part of the chosen, man? Right. This is an honor right here, yo. And then the Lord bringing brothers back that always did it, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, yo, everybody coming there from straight the like, yo, let's go, bro. And look at oh, yeah, it says the angels rejoice when the Israelites like, repent and turn right. back. You know what I'm saying? We see a new brother do a video. And look, look, and a brother come in the name of Yahweh Vashin Abishai. Then a brother say double honors to the elder yep. apostles. Look, look, and the slash elder bishops, yep. giving reverence to their teachers. You gotta do that, bro. You got to. You gotta do that. Uh, a person teach you how to ride a bike. You ain't gonna acknowledge that person. A person that taught you how to tie your shoes and or whatever they teach you. You're not gonna Daniel, Daniel's son is not gonna acknowledge Mr. Miyagi. Right. Right? You know what I'm saying? This man taught you how to protect yourself. You know what I'm saying? Told you how to right. you know what I'm saying? be a man and all that. Right. Oh, you ain't gonna acknowledge that right. man. That's, that's exactly what the elder apostles did yep. through the scriptures, taught us how to be men. Yep. We thought I'm well, being a man with the age shit. Probably had their own crib, maybe a car shit. I'm right. a man with the girlies and all that. Nah, being a man is coming back to this word. Right. This word taught us how to real be men, you know what right. I mean? Brothers growing their beards back, you know what I'm saying? Right. Standing uprightly, ruling their house in order, you know what I'm saying? So it's right. beautiful, man. Just want to throw that out there. Nah, Daniel chapter 7, verse 14. And that was giving him dominion. Yep. Authority, you know yep. what I'm saying, bro? Authority. Dominion. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Um, with the other word power, power yep. the other word colonized. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Yep. All this was given to Lord Yahweh, right? Yep. And glory. And glory. And that's what we see happening. What is glory? The kingdom. Mm -hmm. The kingdom is being established right before our eyes. The kingdom is within us, right? Mm -hmm. You see the great awakening of the hopeful elect. You know, showing showing their 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 uh, uh, their their uh, loyalty and dedication to this this word, man. Yep. Everything's being set up right before our eyes. And then the thing about it, you know what I'm saying, Daniel said he's seen Lord Yahweh Shai being given all this. Mm -hmm. But then you got guys on the earth, you know what I'm saying, trying to take it from Lord Yahweh Shai, right? Mm -hmm. yep. They want the dominion. They want the glory, right? Establishing themselves on the face of the earth, getting on horses and shit like that, right, bro? You know what I'm saying? Walking around, you know what I'm saying? Just running into the pastor like this, bro. Like this, bro. With a little shit like this, bro. And everybody going crazy. No, that's Lord Yahweh Shai, man. He gets that first. Right. You know what I'm saying? 
He gets that when he comes to the earth first, and oh, if it's man. his will, you know what I'm saying, then we get in part a little piece of it, you know what I'm saying? Hey, look, yeah. so be it, yo. Yeah. But we're not gonna rush the process, though, right? We're not yeah. gonna say, oh yeah, Lord, you taking too long, let me jump in front of you. We ain't gonna do that shit, bro. Are you crazy, man? We ain't lay down our life, you know what I'm saying, for nobody, for the nation of Israel. You know right. what I'm saying? That's right. Only one man did that. Lord Yahweh, right? So he's been given the dominion, the glory. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Look, he got it from the Heavenly Father. You know what I'm saying? And the kingdom. Yep. That all people, yep. nations, yep. and languages should serve him. All are going to submit to Yahweh Shai when he comes back. Woo! So really, it's Yahweh Shai's kingdom. Yep. But all will submit to him. Yep. So this is what we're, we're, we're literally witnessing before our eyes, the transition of the, the kingdom being uh, established before our eyes. Right. right. You know, Yahweh Shai, Right? Mm -hmm. Then you had a hopeful elect, the great awakening taking place, man. So this is a dramatic thing happening before the you know, before the earth. Mm -hmm. Can I just say one thing, bro? Mm -hmm. But then you got God talking about so we shouldn't worship Lord Yahweh Shah. Right? They say he's just a spirit, right? You know what I'm saying? Look, look, uh, call, put some respect on their names, mm -hmm. right? You know what I'm saying? Look, I follow know, right? them, right? But don't follow Lord Yahweh Shah, who is giving all this from the Heavenly Father, right? right. You know what I'm saying? The ancient of days, man. Are you serious, man? Right. It says, and languages um, should serve him. His yep. dominion is an everlasting dominion. Everlasting dominion is being set up before our eyes. The right. Lord is getting ready to come back to take what's his, right. rightfully, rightfully his. That's right. And then we're going to get that land back, which is promised to us, rightfully mm -hmm. ours, man. That's right. You know? uh, where those small hats and the, uh, the rest of those, the, the musky, big nose those people, big nose people, Palestinians, all of them in our right. land, yep. part in our land. We're getting ready to get that back. So we encourage. <laughs> You know, uh, the, the the Lord and, and support what the Lord is doing yep. on the face of the earth. We're prophesying against, you know, this rulership that's, that's in, right, in place brother. right now because we know what's to come. That's right. And we fully support it, man. Mm -hmm. That's right. We down with it. We yep. can dig it. You know what I'm yep. saying? We can dig it, man. Right, right. We got no problem. You know what I'm saying? Look, man. Whatever Lord Yahweh should say, you know what I'm saying? Look, man. We down with down it, man. With it. All right? Cause look, Lord, cause look, I'm just gonna say this. Cause everything Lord Yahweh Shai does is perfect. perfect. Why wouldn't you follow that way right there? Nice. Ain't following no ninja out here that's going to hell. Oh, follow, follow a ninja. You no know saying it's talking about having sex on the Sabbath, right, bro? You know what I'm saying? Damn. Boy. And all this other madness, right? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Nah, yo, we following Yahweh Bashim Yahweh yeah, Shai, right. and that's the spirit that the Lord put on us. I'm gonna just finish this, and you okay. get that, bro. Did you have a precept right quick? You got a precept? Yeah. yeah I, Bring I, it I, in, bro. Okay. Okay. Now say what you gonna say first. No, so I, sure. I was just um, backing up the point that you was making about this world being made for us. Right, yep. right, yep. right. Yep. Yep. right. So, um, Second Edris chapter 6, verse 57. And then get the one in um, 7 and 10. I think it's 7, 10 and 11. Once you finish that, get it all to Okay, okay yeah. I got yep, you. Yep, yep, yep. Um, Second Edris chapter 6, verse 57. And now, Lord, O oh Lord, behold, these heathen which have... <laughs> ever been reputed as nothing mm -hmm. have begun to be lords over us mm -hmm. and that's bringing out this words letting these heathen know that they're nothing you see right. so you bring out according <laughs> to the bible the church ain't <laughs> never bring out these kind of scriptures man the, the, the churches tell you that everybody's created equal right but we're at the bottom though right so that's an oxymoron right. right there, right? Everybody's created equal, but we're in the ghettos, though, right? right? We in the poverty stricken neighborhoods. We in the fucking reds, right? right? But oh, yeah, everybody's created equal, right? We broke as shit, you know what I'm saying? You got people rich as hell, but oh, yeah, everybody's created equal. Now, everybody ain't created equal. Deuteronomy 7 and 6 yep. says that we rule over these nations and we right. rule made better than all you nations, man. You see? That's right. What do you say? Um, get it, talk about if you don't mind? Yep. Hold that right quick, bro. I just want to get that right quick. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. You know what I'm saying? Lord made us special, man. That's why we do the things that we do, man. Even at the bottom, man. I know, People right? admire us. I know, they right? pretty much worship us. Yep. King James and things of that nature, man. We're going to have all these heathens, you know what I'm saying, know, bowing right? down to us. Yeah. So come. All of them, yo. All of them. All of them. Dot heads, you know what I'm saying? Must be you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Fucking Chinese, Japanese, you name it, man. The dude eating Africans, which we're not. All of them going to bow down so come. As soon as the Lord come, man. All of them, man. Right. You got it, bro. It's the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7, verse 6. Mm -hmm. For thou art in holy people uh -huh. unto the Lord thy power. Yep. Speaking of the Israelites, we opened up with the 12 tribes. Right. Right? The Israelites, the Lord never forgot about that. Right. That never changed. You got it. The Lord, Yahweh, by Shem, Yahweh, Shai, thy power, have chosen thee to be a special people uh -huh. unto himself mm -hmm. above all people. Above who? Above all people. Above all people, all ah, these nations. Yep. That's why we cook better. We're smarter. Right. More athletic. Yep. You know, wiser. Yep. You know, of course, when we're with our power, mm -hmm. you know, 
but the Lord has chosen us to be a better people than these other nations. And right. that never changed. That's right. You got it. Because right here, you know what I'm saying? Shabbat just read. Mm -hmm. The heathens are reputed as nothing. Yep. I'm saying, even though they over us right, right. about now, a bunch of nobodies over us right about now. You know what I'm saying? Walk around like they're better than us, y'all. Yep. Nobodies, a bunch of nobodies. These heathens are nobodies, you know what I'm saying? And the Lord gave them dominion over the yep. earth right about now. Yo, they own all the businesses. Mm -hmm. Look, look, but we're still over them. You know what I'm saying? We're still we're free to know, right? them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I it's know, the right? power of the Lord, bro. Right. The, 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 you know it was divine Ooh. intervention for us to get caught up on cargo slave ships. Right. Motherfuckers like, no saying, uh, we're a Tookie Williams, right, right. no saying Debo, no saying guys like that, no saying ancient guys like that, warriors, no saying got thrown on cargo slave ships. That's divine intervention, right. yo. He let the heathens do that, man. Took away of our power, yep. man. Yep. Yep. If I can that say it, an example of that was that Jake that was throwing haymakers. With them eating mice. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. I mean, throwing haymakers left and right, man. It was Knock seven them of them. Down. <laughs> so, you know, the Lord had to, had to give this man the power for him to rule over us because he weaker than yep. us, man. Yep. That's why the Lord gave this man the sword because he's weaker mm -hmm. than us, man. Right. It was it was, it, it was uh, purpose. It was the Lord's counsel for yep. him to take us down yep. because we were being disobedient. Mm -hmm. But that didn't change the fact that we're still a special people into to the Lord. Yeah. You know? That's her, that's why everybody desires a so-called Negro, Latino, and Native American Indian. Every woman desires that, and all these other heathen men desire the Native American Indian black, so-called black and Latino woman. You know what I'm saying? You know? Mm -hmm. They desire us, man. You know what I'm saying? They see the things that we do, like, how the hell are you doing, right. Joe? And don't let the Jake know. So you know the women go crazy over Jake. You know what I'm right. saying? You bring out that third leg. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we ain't got to have money, yo. We ain't got to have money. We get with a healing. The healing, you know what I'm saying? Right. Bind us everything. We just pull out the leg. You know what I'm saying? You know? Just keep it in, you know what I'm saying? PG or whatever. Right, right, right. What you finished with that, bro? Just a little bit more in this shop. I'll bring you what's up. It says, above all people that are upon the face of the earth. That never changed, man. The Lord made that. There's no equality. Right. You know? Right. The Lord has favoritism. He has a favorite nation. Mm -hmm. Even amongst the nation, he has favorites among the nation. Right. Yep. You know? And, it's, and that's not going to change. This is the Lord's movie. Yep. He controls everything. This is this is his show. Mm -hmm. You know, it's it's our time to rule, man. You devils right. get aside, man. We know you ain't just gonna give up the kingdom. Right. That's why the Lord's gonna take it. Right. That's right. Show me. This is all um, second entrance. This was that's like your bro. This one was missing the whole time. This knowledge. I know, right? This one was yeah. missing the whole time. Ooh. This knowledge, yo. That's why it was hidden from us. No yeah. for so long. Know, that's right? why it was beaten out of us. <laughs> and then generations later, we, yeah. we don't know nothing. Yep. That first generation. And that's when you know the generation after that, then the generation after that, just keep getting beat, yep. beat, 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 beat. The knowledge get destroyed, no saying you come back not knowing nothing. The only thing you come back knowing, no saying is black. Yep. You know the only thing you come back knowing is African. Right. No saying Native American Indian, all this right. other nonsense. Negro. And that's how you know, no saying that's how you know after three days and a half. No saying Ooh. that Revelation 11 and 11 just come out of the blue, no saying the spirit of life entered into them. And look, and everybody was afraid, yo. Everybody afraid. Great fear fell upon these people. Now they're afraid now, man. Yep. Hell, Putin didn't release, you know what I'm saying? And we've been bringing it out, starting out with our elder apostles and the men that came before them. We've been bringing out the, been bringing out the color scriptures of the Lord, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. The Heavenly Father, the only begotten Son. But uh -huh. a poor man's wisdom falls on deaf ears, despised, you know what I'm saying? So the Lord had to take a heathen, you know what I'm saying? With credible, you know what I'm saying? The struggle yep. to the earth, you know what I'm saying? Everybody was like, oh, you know what I'm saying? Oh, really, really? This right. dude brought it out, you know what I'm saying? It's like, oh, man. Oh, yeah. So if the God of the Bible is black, what's going to happen to us for doing the blacks wrong? You know what I'm saying? They do it wrong. And then that's saying, no. Oh, shit. You mean to tell me that Native American Indians? You mean to tell me that there's somebody that God's people too? We stole that land. What's going to happen? You know what? We're telling you what's going to happen. You right. know what I'm saying? You got it, bro. Okay. <laughs> I, I, I was listening. Bro. I was just in it. You know what I'm saying? Listening. Brothers, get involved. Yo, look, man. This is it, man. This, this is, is um, Second Edges, chapter 6, verse 57. And now, O oh Lord, yep. behold, these heathen, which yep. have ever been re reputed uh -huh. as nothing, uh -huh. have begun to be lords over us uh -huh. and to devour us. Yep. And, and look, as just, uh, he observed that, he knew that. Mm -hmm. these, these heathens are regarded as nothing, but, but they're ruling over us. Mm -hmm. Like, what's going on? You know? They own everything, man. Yep. They own all, all these bitters down here. They own this shit, you know what I'm saying? We just come down here to probably either catch a bus or to walk around because we really can't afford some shit. We ain't fucking with Subway no more. Probably going there and buy a little water just to use right. the bathroom yeah. or some shit like that, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, man, this shit lame to us, man. You know what I'm yep. saying? This shit lame to us, you know? You know what I'm yep. saying? The kingdom of heaven, you're going to really you know what I'm saying, have something to look at when you go to the downtown. You know what I'm saying? Right. But you know, the streets going to be paved yep. and go. It's going to be it's gonna be the thing to to be. Yep. It's going to be the place to be. You know what I'm saying? The kingdom, yo, Jerusalem, it's going to be the place to be. Your streets paved and go. Everything's going to be lavish. You know what I'm saying? You're in stones. You know what I'm saying? So I'll probably have a lapis building or something. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? The whole building made out of lapis. You know what I'm saying? Giving out, you know what I'm saying? A uh, uh, beautiful right. vibration. Energy, yep. You know what I'm saying? 
no saying emerald, no saying emerald. Well, you come to a brother, no saying spot, no saying the whole crib made out of emerald. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Or well, a brother spot made out of um, onyx or something. No uh, saying, or whatever his favorite stone is, man. You see? Carbuckle, you know what I'm saying? Anything, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be beautiful. It's gonna be like this shit, ho. Come downtown, you know what I'm saying? This shit's like sewer, you know what I'm saying? Shit's like sewer, concrete everywhere, fucking car exhaustion, you know what I'm saying? It ain't gonna be like that in the kingdom, yo. This is what happened when the heathens rule, yo. You got it, bro. Uh, second Andrew 6 and 58. But we, uh -huh. thy people, whom thou hast called thy firstborn, mm -hmm. thy only begotten, yo. and thy fervent lover, are given unto their hands. Yep. Look, 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 was given unto their hands. Yep. These heathen ain't strong enough. They ain't like they came and took us. I'm saying, I on their right. own accord. No, it was the will of the Lord, man. Going into um, that's um, Baruch the fourth chapter goes into that. You know what I'm saying? How the Lord said, I, yeah, I gave you over to these heathen. You yep. know what I'm saying? And I had you hauling ass out of your land. You know what I'm saying? Yep. God goes inside like we left the land, you know what I'm saying? Mourning mm -hmm. and crying and all that. Mm -hmm. But we're going to turn back, you know what I'm saying? With a smile on our face, yep. pretty much. The land going to receive us, you know what I'm saying? With honor and glory. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Things of that nature, just roughly paraphrasing. Uh, but the Lord gave these heathen power, you know what I'm saying? To take us down, man. Yep. You got it, bro? Uh, I think they will finish that and then you got it. Oh, you, yeah, you got to finish that before he read. Just one more. Yeah, go ahead. Bro. Okay. 59. If the world now be made for our sakes, uh -huh. why do we not possess an inheritance with the world? And now, we, and if I can say, now we know that. We understand that scripture now mm -hmm. through experience. Mm -hmm. We understand why we were taken down uh, for a period of time and these heathens ruling over us. Mm -hmm. Now we get it. We're the children. The whole time we're the children of Israel, yeah. bro. The whole time. We were the special people that the, the scripture is talking about the whole time, but we effed up, mm -hmm. you know. And this is what's, what this is why order is being set up because we're, the Lord's having mercy on us again. That's right. In the last part, how long shall this endure? How long are we gonna go through this? Yeah. But we see now that our punishment is coming to an end. Mm -hmm. The Lord is taking the curses off of us slowly, slowly but surely. One of the reasons why we know now because the Lord He, he turned His face from us. We got the names back. Yep. Yeah. The Lord took his name from us. That means he wasn't dealing with us. Now we get the name back. Now we, we come, we're going back to the ancient way that, like the brothers going into earlier. Brothers going their beards now. Yes. You know, being masculine now, righteous, yep. showing brotherly love and charity. Say that. Yep. You know? See, our here, our eyes not evil towards each other. You know what I'm saying? Right. The rest of our people, their eyes evil towards each other. The Lord put his spirit on us to say, the hell with that. You know what I'm saying? When right. you see your brother, you know what I'm saying? You look at him, you know what I'm saying? As you, right. as yourself. Oh, yeah, when it says, it says um, when, you, when you see your brother, you're, you're basically seeing the Lord. You know right. what I'm saying? Right. So when we look at each other, we see we see you how it's shot. You know what I'm saying? It's all good, bro. I want to get this right quick, if I may. Then talk about you can get yours. Jeremiah chapter 17, verse 4. And thou, even thyself, shall discontinue no. from thy inheritance no. that I gave thee. Yeah, we, hey, look, the Lord said we're going to be discontinued from our heritage, from our nationality. Why, hey, look, that's why we were going after idols, calling on uh, uh, these uh, heathen gods or whatever. I guess you Jake knowing the, I, no, I'm just going to say, I guess Jake knowing the spirit, that his bag is the only safe, safe place, you know what I'm saying? It's yeah. near us, you know yeah. what I'm saying? This this it, man. This is that sanctuary right. right here, man. This is a safe place, man. Right. Holy ground, man. Yeah. Straight up, man. Why do you think when dogs come by, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You have a person walk past with their dog, and their dog is safe. I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> the, woman, the woman be like, Poopsie, I know, right? Poopsie, what's going on? Yeah, Poopsie, she time. be smiling and all that, and the dog be looking at us. Be like, yo, the dog don't want to leave, yo. Come on, Poopsie. They got to end up grabbing Poopsie and picking them up and all that, Hell walking yeah. down the street. This is a safe place, man. That's you right. see? This is, this is where you can actually find comfort at. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because we got the comfort. You know what I'm yeah. saying? It says, And thou, even thyself, shalt discontinue from thy heritage yep. that I gave thee. And I will cause thee to serve thine enemies in the land which thou knowest not. And that's why we we in the condition we in to this day. Because the Lord put us in this condition. Yep. We effed up bad. And we learned through experience, like the prodigal son, the one that went out and was going off, but came back, man. So now we're back, you know, and Lord willing, we endure. You know? <laughs> Lord raising his men up, y'all. So it's all good. Oh yeah, y'all know it's um women in power's mud now. Today is women in power's mud, no sense. So you got all these that's why you got all these indulges walking through those with the high heels, you know what I'm saying, walking through France and all that. You can't get our attention. We men, of course, so we might look or whatever, yeah. glance or whatever, but we're on a mission right about now. Yeah. You see? Either get down or lay down, you know what I'm saying? Because America ain't gonna be around too much longer, you know what I'm saying, to keep pushing that um that effeminate yep. nonsense, yep. that that queen of heaven nonsense and shit. We we at the end of it, yo. I'm saying this shit. Remember them years ago, you know what I'm saying? Because all of us around the same age, Jay used to go crazy over Eve. Yeah, you know, yeah. Like, fuck Eve. You got yeah, all these yeah. different podcasters saying F Eve yep. now, man. Yep. Oh, yeah, she got all these dudes making videos talking about some weird, we're in our soft era now. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? We're not soft. So you got dudes, you know what I'm saying? Pretty much, it's just a joke. Pretty yeah, yeah, much. Yeah, yeah, but it's yeah. like, what you gonna do for me now? Right. That's what men are saying now. I'm not doing nothing. That's, That's right. If, if she's not your wife, don't cut the damn grass. Yep. You know what I'm saying? They ain't no more cutting grass. <laughs>
It ain't no more cutting grass. It ain't no more pumping gas. Right. Ain't no more. Clean ain't no car. more dates. No, 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 I'm not cash up. You know that money. What about lunch? Or none of that shit. Yeah. Look, look, you cash me, ask me twenty dollars. No saying. Look, look, send that shit back to it. No saying. You better cash out me one hundred and fifty. <laughs> ain't that what they do? Yep. Ain't that what yep. they do? Yep. So, so tables are turning there. No yep. saying. Because the yep. Lord basically showing these women how foolish they have been acting the yep. whole time. Yep. What's the which they know, man? Motherfuckers ain't as dumb as they, they look, you know what I'm saying? Right. These motherfuckers are smart, man. They know what they're yeah, doing yeah. the whole time, but now it's, it's falling on their head now. Yep, yep. All that bullshit's come back to bite them in the ass. Now nobody, nobody don't want that um that demon type of spirit that's within no. them. Everybody like, oh, no, 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 I'm good. Where the heathens at? Uh, Where the heathens at? Know, Where, right. Where Karen at? You know what I'm saying? Right. Where Christy <laughs> at? You know what I'm saying? Because Christy ain't Christy. When I see Christy, she, I ain't got to have on a thousand dollar pair of shoes. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I ain't got to have on fucking expensive jabos. You know what I'm saying? Right. I ain't got to make um, six figures. Right. You know what I'm saying? All this other nonsense. That Average Jake ain't even fucking making them say over fucking um, fifty thousand a year. Yo, we in Babylon. Yo. We in we in slavery. Yo. The Lord said, I, "You discontinued from your heritage, and I gave you over mm -hmm. to your enemies in a land you ain't even know." Right. For ye have kindled a fire in mine anger, which shall burn forever, which is a period of time. Right. It's like a rock was going into. We got the um the true proper names in the Hebrew right. tongue back now. So that fire, you know what I'm saying, is being um, um pretty Ignited. much uh, doused out, you know what I'm oh, yeah, saying, yeah, with yeah, water, yeah, you know what I'm saying, which is this word, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. what, you, what you say, though, bro? Yeah, my fault. I use the word. Oh, you good. Word. Yeah, yeah. Well, you're right. Put no, out. What? I say ignited, but I'm thinking about it. Oh, yeah, it, yeah, you know, ignited, you know what I'm saying, it's a light back up, right? But the, Lord, yeah. the fire is getting ignited within uh -huh. us, you know what I'm yeah. saying? So we'll take that right there, you know what I'm saying, and flip that right quick. It's bro. all law, though, yeah. man. That the Lord put his spirit in us, you know what I'm saying, to come back, man, to wake up, man, and to come out here and stand up in front of everybody, yo, and declare your how about you know what the gospel, regardless of how these people look at us, yo. It don't matter these people, you everybody can look at all crazy but we're looking at them like they crazy because yep. we got the truth and then these people are common folks yep. you know what i'm saying yep. these people are common folks you know what i'm saying man upper echelon out here you know what i'm saying these common folks i'm saying why why we gonna care about what people say about it's gonna die soon come yeah we're gonna delete these people that's walking through yo yeah you right. got it bro i think you had some bro yeah, yeah bring up what you got did you finish your shopping? Yeah, I'm good. Oh yeah, I want you to read seven, um, chapter seven. Uh, i think it's or 10 and 11. 11. I think it's 10 11. yeah because 10 goes into 11. yeah okay. yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. Let him read this first, you know what I'm saying? Then, yeah, 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 I got yeah, you. Yeah, read yours first, bro. Yeah, yeah read yours first. Yeah. Yeah, shop in the building, you know what I'm saying? Uh, oh, link your brothers back up, man. You know what I'm saying? Brothers love bro. each other, man. Straight up, man. Second entrance, chapter 7, verse 9. If this city now were given unto a man for an inheritance, right. if he never shall pass the danger set before it, how shall he receive this inheritance? Well, and I said, it is so, Lord. Right. Then said he unto me, even so also is Israel's portion. Right. Because for their sakes, I made Ooh. the world. For their sakes, the Lord created the earth. For the Israelites' sake, the earth was created. And look, look, it's a Bible scripture. You read the scripture like, yo, the earth was created for us the whole time? This whole earth, the you know what I'm saying? We only seen little fractions of it, you know what I'm saying? Even brothers that travel and things of that nature, they only seem like it, 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 little bitty, bitty pieces of the earth. Yo, the earth, the earth is vast. It's vast, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. We ain't seen shit yet, yo. It's parts of the earth that the Lord don't want nobody to see yep. but Israel. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Woo. It's places that sleazy he ain't even seen, yo, with all his planes and all that. He fly yeah. off everything, but the Lord still, in certain parts of the earth, the Lord, you yep. know what I'm saying, had a plane get shut down uh -huh. and it'll crash, you know what I'm yep. saying? So to make sure this man don't see certain parts, man. Uh, Oasis, mm -hmm. uh, Amazon, Amazon, and shit like yep. that. Yeah. It's devil through, yo. Right. Hold on, Slim. We're going to get this right quick. Finish this off. Okay. Second day, just but oh yeah, can let me just say this, bro. Yeah. But everybody's worried about a J. Cole concert and things of this nature. You know, you know what I'm saying? When, when this glorious word is know, being right? you know what I'm saying, spoken in the earth once again, yo. This is what gives us hype, you know what I'm saying? Not a damn J. Cole concert. Right. And Slim was bringing out last week, you know what I'm saying? The one that last week when they had it. Yep. Yeah, yeah it cost like a thousand dollars for some tickets, yep. bro. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. For a J. Cole yep. ticket, bro. I'm you know saying, look, for a bottle of water. Yeah, five dollars, five dollars <laughs> for a bottle of water, yo. You know what I'm saying, bro? That's that's crazy, yeah, right? Nah. But but them niggas had to get it, you know what I'm saying? Because they were standing dead in the sun. Cause that big hole duck oh, yeah, next yeah, area yeah. is nothing but sun and a couple of little trees. You no, know so I rolled past it yesterday. <laughs> you got it, bro. Because for their sakes I made the world. And that people don't even consider that, man. They, they, the pastor would never read a scripture like this that the earth was created for you, so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Right. Look, we're coming straight out the Bible with it. Straight out the Bible. Straight out the what, Bible. what Bible is that? What Bible is that? Right. The same Bible in your church, or either the same Bible that's at your house collecting right. dust. It's right. the same Bible, man. Or, or the Bible that's in your car, no saying it's been open, John 3, 16 for the last know, five right? years, and then it got sunburned, no <laughs> saying, bro. The page is all burnt looking, no saying. Right? But you just been yeah, John 3, 16. Right. Come on, man. Our people need to wake the hell up, man. You got it, bro. And, uh, and when Adam transgressed my statue, right. then was the decree that now is done. Right, so ever since our forefather Adam went off, we're here now. Yep. You know what I'm saying? 
gotta work, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Says by the um, sweat of thy brow, yep. shall thou work, you know what I'm saying? Day and night, says that you're gonna find no rest among these heathens. Yeah. We were scattered among the heathens, we had no rest. We had rest two times, you know what I'm saying? That was doing King Solomon and King mm -hmm. David, you see? Yep. Especially yep. King Solomon, you know what I'm saying? Because there was nobody coming up against us. King David had to, you know what I'm saying, take down these uh -huh. heathens. You know what I'm yeah. saying? But then King Solomon came with 40 years of peace. Bro, 40 years of peace. Bro, long, long, long as you no know saying the earth, you no know saying people been on the earth yeah. 40 years old, yeah. peace, bro. Did you know that? Mm -hmm. The earth is like what, 13, 13,000 years old? You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? So, um, no. Give or take, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I know, you know what I'm saying? The first, you know what I'm saying, was 7,000, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Up until now, you know what I'm saying? Which the earth ain't no billion years, you know what I'm saying? Wow. So it's like 13,000 years old, right? Yeah. Give or take, you know what I'm saying, a couple of years, right? But just think, bro, out of 13,000, 40 years, bro. Ooh, you know what I'm that was supposed to rule. Yep. Bro, <laughs> bro, we doing bad, right, yep. bro? You got it, yep. bro. That's why Jeremiah said, "Is Israel a homeborn slave?" We, we've been we've been in slavery and and, and going off for years, man. Mm -hmm. We've experienced the kingdom of preview for forty years, bro. Mm -hmm. You know, so all this is is coming to an end where mm -hmm. everlasting kingdom is about to be set up. This all the Lord's movies, yep. you know. You finished with that, bro? Yes, sir. Yep, yes, sir. Let's get this brother right here. Yeah, get going. <laughs> yeah, we brother Keith, so get y'all's about the way because he's been holding his for a minute too. <laughs> this is the book of Psalms, chapter fifty, verse twenty-one. These things hast thou done, and I kept silence. If thou thoughtest that I was altogether such as one as thyself, but I will reprove thee. Yeah. And that's speaking to Esau, right. the so-called white man. Because he's been in rulership for a long time, he thought the Lord was with him. Mm -hmm. You know, he got all these, these, these islands. He, you know, run, stole his land. Stole the land. And, and look, we talk about signs. Look, they, they said Cristobal Columbus, he had a sign on the way over on the way over to take this land because mm -hmm. it was his time to rule the lord was setting up this man to rule for his period of time so he thinking the lord with him they took down the nation of israel we got to be we, right. we got to be those people manifest destiny. manifest destiny you know the lord is with us right. that's what he's thinking so we brought, we brought all these Negroes over here. They're saying big, like I was going into earlier, uh, uh -huh. for the Tukey Williams. Right. They're saying, the big dudes, yo. They don't wrestling looking dudes. They're saying was on the slave ships, bro. Mm -hmm. I'm saying that's who mainly they had on um, popping the yep. women. With them big dudes, yep. I'm saying we was getting in there, they were letting yep. us get it in every now and then, you know what I mean? Right. Smaller guys like us, whatever, you know what I'm saying? But them big basketball, yep. football looking dudes, they was the ones because they were trying to make them bucks, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, they was breeding them, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Yep. So look, you take down a dude like that, you think most definitely the Lord's with you, but the Lord, which the Lord was with him at that yep. point in time, you know what I'm saying? Because to fulfill prophecy, or whatever, but he wasn't with you, with you, you know what I'm saying? It wasn't like with you as far as then you're going to rule forever. Right. It was like he was with you just to take us down. Because, look, he used this devil, you know what I'm saying, to take us down. Yep. They ain't going to use us to take this devil Ooh. down. Right. We're going right back into Ezekiel, what is it, 25? Is that Ezekiel 25 and 14? I'm going to yep. use my people, yep. you know what I'm saying, to take these heathens yeah, down. Yeah, you yeah, yeah. paraphrase it? Yeah. I think it's 25. Yep. Yeah, 14, right? Yeah. Oh, I think so. Yep. Oh, I'm going to use my, I'm gonna use my people, oh, Israel, to take your yeah. heathens down, you know what I'm saying? Yep. You know, you got it, bro. It says, and set them in order before thine eyes. Yep, and that's what you see, order is being set up right before, right before their eyes. Mm -hmm. And this is why the elites are afraid. Yep. You know, they try, they try to you know, keep the information from us that we're the Israelites for a long time, the elites. You know, they're afraid, because we, we're back, we're, we're, the order is being back set up again. All right, and this is, and, and one of your brothers can give me all of Judith, Judith, the fifth chapter, verse 17, in the GNT. See, the thing is, with these heathens, they know, the, the, the elites, they know the playbook. They, they got the rundown on Israelites. They study the Israelites, yeah. the history, and they know that we're hard to be defeated when we're aligned with our power. I know that right, bro. Shot. They know that. And, hey, you got to give it to Esau. Esau is a cunning uh, hunter. Yep. Yeah. And, hey, hey, when, you know, when you're a cunning hunter, you know you're prey. Yep. You know who you're going after. So they already know that the Israelites, when the Israelites is with you, how about you shot? Undefeated. Why do you think they they uh pay so much money? Like uh the apostles often go into the elite saw the apostles on the street. How did y'all yeah. find out? Yep. Why do you think they pay billions of dollars to keep the name from us? Mm -hmm. To hide uh, King David's crown, all these different things because yep. they know when we went when we went the Lord, unstoppable. Every year they push for something else. They are yep. one year you're African American, that's meant many. You're Afro American, that's meant you're Afro Latino. Right. That's meant you know what I'm saying you're black. That's meant you know you're la um, um, Latino. Right. That's meant you know you're native. You know what I'm saying Indian. All this, it's over and over and over and right. over. And they have our people on um, push forth that nonsense. Yep. The people pay people like Jesse Jackass yep. Jackson and all these yeah, other yeah, ninjas. Yeah, you know what I'm saying yeah. they push forth their madness, man. They pay them big money, bro. They 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 pay these ninjas big money. You know 
saying? The, uh, the, uh, keep that poor job coming our way, man. You see? Right. Going right back into um, Psalms 83. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Psalms chapter 83. You know what I'm yep. saying? On down how all these heathens were saying, and all these heathens came together. Yep. And then you go to Lamentations, the first chapter, and go to how these heathens were glad that the Lord took us down. Yep. You know what I'm saying? They rejoiced. They rejoiced at our downfall, bro. Yep. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Uh, say, say, say they was glad when thou did it, you know what I'm saying? And, and then the scripture say, goes to how like um as thou hast done unto us, do unto them for all their wickedness. Yep, yep. So my size are many. We sign a crime. That's, that's why the Lord said, the poor. Well, that's why we just bring it, just bring out the word. And the Lord says, seek ye first the kingdom of heaven, and all things shall be added. But then you got guys seeking women. Seeking fortune, seeking fame, but then they seek the God of the Bible last. It don't work that way. Wow, wow. Seek first the kingdom of heaven, which starts off yep. with this word, then everything else. Come on, man. Yep. Rulership. That's what we seek. We seek a rulership, dominion over, over the whole earth, right. you know what I'm saying? Upon our Lord and Savior, man. Yep. That's what we seeking, man. Right. Seeking this nonsense. All this stuff gonna burn soon come. That's right. You know what I'm saying? If we some of those men, everything gonna submit soon come anyway. So why chase something that's gonna submit to you? That's you know what I'm saying? Right. A little while anyway. One thing you need to do is just stay focused, of course, man. Right. I'm, I right. must be allowed to bring out this before yep. you bring out that slim. Revelation 11 11 and it reads, and after three days and a half, mm -hmm. the spirit of life. Brother, somebody get um St. John 6 and 63. Revelation um, 11 and 11, which the word revelation means to reveal, right? Uh -huh. Out of three days and a half, 350 years, right? From 1620 to 1970, give or take a couple of years, 68, 69. Mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? I think um, I preached our Bibbin, you know what I'm saying, was bringing out the scriptures, but he was like just bringing out the, um, the Old, Old Testament. Testament yep. Then the Lord put the spirit on him to go into the new yep. and the old, you know what I'm saying? Yep. The volume of the yep. book, Ooh. Psalms 40 and 7, the volume of the book, and he left the commandment keeper. You know what I'm saying? Yep. See? You know what I'm saying? Look, the, we, you can't forget about because if you're just the commandment keepers, then you forgot about the Savior, Lord exactly. Yahushua. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You got no, it, bro. Exactly. Now you got it, bro. That was it with John the Baptist. Right. John the Baptist doing his own thing. He came right. out with the gospel. Yep. You know, started preaching the New Testament. That lines up right. with yep. him. You know, lines up. Lines up perfect. John the Baptist, you know what I'm saying, was a forerunner for Lord Yahushua. Yep. High priest Alba Bivens was a forerunner yep. for Lord Yahushua, right? Say, you know what I'm saying? Um, you're gonna, um, a man going to rise up and bring yep. you back to the fathers. You yep. know what I'm saying? John the Baptist did that, right? You know what I'm saying? You see? And then uh, John the Baptist said, you know what I'm saying? I baptize you with water. Yep. But one that's mightier than I, I I'm yep. not even worthy to um, lace up his shoes. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. It's going to baptize you with water and fire, yep. which is this word. You know what I'm saying? Right. It's a beautiful thing. Look, we weren't doing this years ago, man. Yep. We weren't pre precept, we weren't precept. It's going into a hype and all that. And people know, like people in your family, they know when you're uh, really into something. And they see how passionate you are. Yeah. So my people could tell that I was really into the Bible, how passionate yep. I was about you know what I'm saying? Yep. How fiery you know what I'm saying? Yep. I was for it, man. That's the spirit of the Lord right there, man. Right. And every brother's like that, man. Uh, uh, you see? That's why when you first come in, you're trying to teach everybody. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> and all that. And the Lord's like, man. Hey, it's your life. Nah, man. You know what I'm saying? All, all your family hate you. You know what I'm saying? Right, right, right. You know. Because they love us when we into wickedness, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. The scriptures go to, um, um, you, know, you are the word. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The love world you. love you. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Love it says, home. um, after three days and a half, I'm saying, look, and that's how you know who we are according to the Bible, the Israelites with lively stones at those um, um, plantations and Christian churches, everybody dead as hell, right. especially the um, heathen churches. Know, right? They got Jacob in there dancing and all that, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, but with the heathens, thou art, uh, look, right, right. John right. 6, yeah. And all this with no salt, no flavor, nothing else. I'm saying, at least up in the, you know what I'm saying, um, in the uh, so called black church yeah, no, or whatever. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, like know, Eddie Griffin right. said, Jesus love me. Jesus love me. They be in there getting down. But not these seasons, man. Because we're the salt of the earth, man. Even in our wickedness, you know what I'm saying? We, we the best because, yeah. look, we Jacob. Yep. We the best when it comes to doing righteous, yep. and we the best when it comes to doing wickedness, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? The right hand and left. You know what I'm uh, saying? Because uh, uh, remember, it says, the scripture says, um, um, the wicked of our people have talked, you know what I'm saying? The, the wicked, how to be wicked. You yep. know what I'm saying? So the wicked looking at our people, sleeps, eating, eating my looking at our people like, you know what I'm saying? We're right. Right, 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 right. I, I ain't even think of that right now. Right. We wicked and self, I ain't think about that. Because Jake go on, uh, over and beyond, you yep, know what I'm saying? Yep. Especially when Jake, not just gonna yeah, say when right. Jake, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, the men yeah. put on their yeah. dresses and all that shit. Yep. The men of our nation really go to press and, and oh, all that shit, right? Yeah. And Sleazy, like, that is! You, know <laughs> you got to rob it. Diddy, that's why Diddy is so, uh, <laughs> you know, you got Esau and you got Diddy. Yeah, rip Diddy up, showing them, yeah. like, yo, this is how you do it. You know what I'm saying? Diddy going all out, man. That's why everybody's talking about him. Right. You know, Diddy's a perfect example of, of, of a high level wicked uh, Jake, man. Right, yeah. And yeah. showing Esau things. Esau was like, dang it. Yeah. Should you ain't never had no heathen woman, you know what I'm saying, go to the damn um, deletion um, uh, facility. Y'all right. know what I mean by yeah, that. Yep, yep. that uh, deletion facility right. and start twerking and shit, you know what I'm right. saying? Jake did that shit. Be running from the deletion oh, facility, man, twerking man. and shit, you know what I'm saying? And promoting this shit. Talk about baby daddy free. 
You, you ain't right. never heard no saying Sleazy E or any of these seasons. Talking about them, they, they want to delete they, um, um, their offspring. Right. You know what I'm saying? Or if they baby daddy and all that. You know what I'm saying? Right. They make it a hit. You know what I'm saying? Just making a hit, bro. In a classic. Right. I'm going to read on just to finish it out. Revelation 11 11. And after three days and a half, the spirit of life, meaning this word, get that right quick, bro. Just to prove what the spirit of life is. Either one of y'all got it. St. John 6 63. You got to bring it up. John chapter 6, verse 63. It is the spirit that quickens. Right. Mm. The flesh profited nothing. That's why we ain't worried about the outer appearance. I you got know, these right? other Israelite groups, they're they more worried about the outer appearance. You know what I'm saying? That's why they got the armbands and right. all that shit. You know what I'm saying? They worried about what people perceive of the out. You know what I'm saying? The Lord said, yeah, the cup, no sense, clean on the outside. But I'm going to what about the inside of it. You know what I'm saying? Right. Damn dead man. You know what I'm saying, bro? <laughs> damn dead man inside that, that damn frame. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Pretty much said a sepulchre, right? You know what I'm right. saying? Corpse. Yeah, damn corpse, bro. <laughs> you got it, bro. And we having fun out here, too, man. You see? You it, got it. It is the spirit that quickens them. Right. The flesh profit of nothing. Right. The words that I speak unto you, and that's going into how, like, no saying you can't um, look at a man and say he's a he's a heathen. No saying because the spirit look like like you got um, guys in on great mist on to make look like a heathen or something like that. It's the spirit that's inside of him. No saying that makes him an Israelite. The spirit has been quickened. I'm saying so. We don't look on the outer appearance, right? That's right. The flesh profit of nothing, man. Go ahead. The flesh profit of nothing. Right. The words that I speak unto you. Right. They are spirit and right. they are life. So we we enter into the Hebrew Israelites, the spirit. That's we right. enter into the hopeful elect of the nation of Israel, the spirit, mm -hmm. meaning his word. You know what I'm saying? That's what made us live again. That's right. Because that word uh, quicken means to make alive. That's you know what I'm saying? Right. So the Lord made us live again. We can't thank the Lord enough, man. We was dead as hell, bro. Right. You know what I'm saying? Probably, you know what I'm saying? Smoking uh, blickies. Right. You know what I'm saying? Little blunts or whatever. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Selling a look here and there. All kind of nonsense. Worshiping yep. Christmas. Yep. Uh, oh, shit. You know, Valentine's Day was popular. You know what I'm saying? Every brother out here bought some damn know, right? and shit. Some chocolate covered hearts and uh, things of yeah. that nature, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we worship our birthdays and all that, you know what I'm uh -huh. saying? Worship our mama, you know what I'm saying? Birthday uh -huh. and all that. Celebrated all that other nonsense. Right. Just, just, just black culture in a whole, you know what I'm saying? Lord, like, no, nah, I quickened you from that. You know what yeah. I woke you up from that, man. You're uh -huh. alive now. Don't go back to that nonsense. Right. Right? And then you look back at your old pictures like y'all was through a shit. You don't even want to look at you, you threw away I your know, old right? pictures and shit. Y'all know, right? We are how you used to look. I heard you had breaks. I don't give a damn about that, man. You got women that meet you and shit, but like, yo, I don't, I don't, I don't. You, you, you ever had braids before? Here, here we go with that braids shit, you know what I'm saying? Yo, let me see some old pictures, yo. Fuck that old man, you know what I'm saying? Somebody that new man now. Fuck that old man. The old right. man was wicked as hell, yo. He was, he was just a simple. He was simple as hell. Look, look, I'm in love with the new man. You know what I'm saying? Right. He's being renewed every day, you know what I'm saying? That new man that I'm fighting that old man to get away from, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It says, um, the, um, the spirit of life entered into them, which is proven, which is the word, and they stood upon their feet. We are here now. Woo. Stood upon our feet, declaring Yasha Allah. We ain't yep. declaring black no more, bro. Right. You know what I'm saying? We're not declaring Native American Indian no more. You know what I'm saying? And all that other nonsense. Right, what else? We're not declaring being a Latino right. no more. We're declaring being an Israelite. Yasha right. Allah, Prince of the Power. That whole weight, man. Yep. Being black don't hold no way. Look, look at everybody that's walking around calling themselves black. They dead right. as hell. Yep. What's the word black means? Dead, dead. anyway. Yep. Void of life. Know what I'm saying? Right. Pretty, much, pretty much, yeah, wicked. Know what I'm saying? Yep. Like Shabba said. Yep. It says, and they stood upon their feet, and great fear fell upon them which saw them. Yeah, and look, who, who's seeing this going on? The elites, these other nations? They see what's going on. All right, they're like, oh man, uh, uh, they're not they're not calling themselves black anymore. We gotta right. do something. Boy, the cat is out the bag. The spirit, yep. they look, that divine intervention, the brother mm -hmm. mentioned. Hey, that divine intervention is happening. You can't stop it. Yep. The everlasting kingdom is being set up. Is, which is given to you out shot. You can't stop it. There's order that comes with that. So they're they're afraid. Yep. You know? And this is why they know that they gotta speed up time. Yep. Because they know that time is running short. Tell them about getting up yeah. Um one of your brothers get that Judah. Can you, can you finish with Judah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah uh, Judah. Uh, uh, started seventeen and then TNT. We pretty much finished with it Daniel four. Yeah, just get it out yeah, of the way, right? Yep, yep, that yep, wasn't yep. powerful. Daniel chapter 7, verse 14, it reads, And there was given him dominion and glory yep. and a kingdom that all people, uh -huh. all people, mm -hmm. all people, yep. everybody, man, that all people, nations, and languages should serve him. Mm -hmm. His dominion is, is an everlasting dominion uh -huh. which, shall, which shall not pass away. Mm -hmm. And his kingdom that which shall, and his kingdom that which shall not be destroyed. There you go. A kingdom is about to be established, it's never gonna be destroyed ever. It's happening right before our eyes. No, but um, um Bishop Nathaniel said, you know what I'm saying? These heathens gonna say, right. <laughs> 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 Yeah, 
<laughs> but all this other madness, you know what I'm saying? You get over here, and when they come through, I need you to chop out. <laughs> 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 I need you, and I need you, and I need you, and you, and you, and you, and you, and you, and you to just call, man. That ain't gonna happen, man. Ain't no heat of getting up a coup and all this nonsense, bro. You know what I'm saying? Right. So, and then they look like um, they working over there when they're talking. Right, right. And here he come walking to the back. <laughs> come on, man. We got, we got uh, well, task masters yeah. over these heathens, man. Yeah. Ain't nobody rebellion. They're going to see all that power. And the chariots going to be there. And the angels going to yep. be over there, man. Yep. Come on, man. Says we're going to judge <laughs> angels. When, when you go into that strip, it ain't like the angels going to be going off or whatever. Right. We're just going to be able to control the angels. Like, yo, yep. go do this. Go do yep. that. Go do that. Because the angels ain't going to go off. Right. Not, so you, that's why you got to know what I'm saying. Strap them. Right. You know what I'm saying? When it says judge, we're not going to be judging them as far as the, the angel ate some pork. So now we got to rebuke them yeah. and all that. No, man. Nah. Look, um, go do this. Go right. do that. Look, hey, brothers, Making it call on election sure, man. Everybody, right. man, making That's it call right. on election sure, y'all. That's right. No matter we get phone calls, whatever, man, bro, just out on their post, you're like, yo, the Lord got us. Yep. Mm. You got it. Bro. If I can say that, it, it, bro. It, but the Edomites rise up, which we know that's not going to happen. Right. That will be considered war. Which right. Say there, there should be no more war. Right. War war. Yeah. That's it, man. Mm -hmm. Everlasting kingdom is, 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 about, is about to be set up and yep. never be destroyed ever again. So, yep. huh. This is just what I was about to say. Kingdom, this thing will be spirit created vengeance. Oh, yeah. Yep. 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 And, and the elements. Now I'm just going to say, bro, if I can, we're going to be able to read minds. Yep. Yep. And all that, yo. Oh, yo, that thing thinks about nonsense. You just send a lion over there to eat his ass. You know what I'm saying? You know, if I could just pull him, take a lion, you know what I'm saying? Just drag him over there to where the crocodiles at. You know what I'm saying? Or either drag him over there to where some uh, quicksand at. I know, just right. fall into the quick. Come on, we're going to be meditating, term, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Yeah, yeah, yep. This is the GNT, book. right? Yep. yep. This is the book of Judah, chapter 5, verse 17. Their oh, God gosh. hates wickedness. Read that again. Their God hates wickedness. Number one. Uh huh. You got it. And as long as they did not sin against him, they prospered. Yep. So, Damn. hey, look, look, the enemy had a rundown on the Israelites. Damn. The enemy said, look, their God hates wickedness. Damn. As long as they're good with their God, you, 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 you wow. can't touch them. They're going to be prosperous. They're going to be off the chain. It's, wow. gonna, it's gonna be you it's gonna be impossible to defeat them. Damn. You know? You got it. Read that again. Yeah, read, read that again from the top. So long, bro. So long, bro. Chapter 5. Chapter 5, verse 17. The book of Judah. Not Ruth. Judah. No, I said Judah. Oh, okay. It's a lot of I thought I heard Ruth. Yeah, yeah, it's a lot yeah, of it. Yeah. It's all good, good though, bro. <laughs> We're correct, you know what I'm saying? Some people don't say, what are you saying, man? Maybe all in the room, right? I don't see that. Yeah, I'm saying. So Judah, yo. This is the book of Judah. Uh -huh. Chapter 5, verse 17. Yep. Their God hates wickedness. Uh -huh. Damn. And as long as they did not sin against him, yep. they prospered. Hey, look, the enemy knows that. That's why the enemy's in fear. Yep. They see us stand up on our feet. Uh -huh. that, that, oh man, they found the Israelites. Oh shit. They call on oh they call on the Lord. They know the Lord's name. They got all of the, the relics and the things in there stored in on uh, the Vatican in different areas. They know what's up, man. All right now. All right, Shalom. 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 Uh, water, hey, bro. Water, brother. Water, bro. Hey, yeah, I'm going to shout out Brother Thaw, bro. Shalom, bro. For real, man. Hey, Shalom. Yeah, man. All you brothers, man. All you brothers. For real, man. Yeah, man. Hey. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying, bro. Man. I just look, man. That, that's on this side, that, man. Lord, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, what can we say? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <clears throat> um, yeah, man. It's, we live in some beautiful times, man. This is a part of the ministry, man. You know, hey, Israel's making that call on election sure, man. You know? You know what I'm saying? We, we Bro, coming to the man. You know, the order's being set up, man. It's a beautiful thing going on right now, man. But look, man, nobody can be against when the Lord is for us, who can be against us, bro? And the scripture says, that's why we put our confidence, our faith in the Lord, man. Yeah, man. Are you like brothers talking about their phones getting called and things of that nature? We got confidence in the Lord, so right. whatever happens is meant to happen. You know what I'm yep. saying? Yep. Everything that happens in our life is meant to happen. You know what I'm right. saying? So why, why stress it? You know what I'm saying? It's the Lord's moving. You know what I'm saying? Right. Just continue to focus. The Lord said, I, I got to keep doing this. Mm -hmm. I got to continue to do this right here, no matter what happens. You know what I'm right. saying? Yep. That's right. You, you get taken out, you know what I'm saying? Look, man, you back up there with the Heavenly Father right. and the Son. What, what, what is it, though, dog? Exactly. What I is know, it, dog? Right. I mean, what do you really think? You're going to do something to me and I'm going right. to hell or something? Right. Uh -huh. Right. No, bro, no right, man. Right, right, you do right. something to any brother out here, you know what I'm saying? Starting out with the elder apostles, men on down. We back up there with Lord, yep. the Heavenly Father, and Lord Yahweh, yep. man. It's nothing, right. man. And the Heavenly Host, man. Yep, Lord willing, right. you know what I'm saying? Get ready to come back down and receive a crown, man. Right. See? The Lord said, you know what I'm saying? Um, um, what do you say? Um, it's precious in the eyes of the saints. They, um, get, uh, get put the devil, something like oh, that. Uh, 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 precious is in the sight of his saints and die, something like that. Brother, know what scripture I'm talking about? In the eyes of the Lord, you know what I'm saying? It's precious. In the eyes of the Lord to see one of his men get um get oh, with the devil for the gospel. 
precious in the, in the sight of the Lord, but one of his men, you know what I'm saying? That's what's coming to my mind right about now. I know I I'm nothing to paraphrase. You got it? You got it. Psalms chapter 116, <laughs> verse 15. Right. Precious in the sight of the house by Hashem Yahweh Right. is the death of his saints. See? So, so, so one of us do have to fast, you know what I'm saying? It's precious in the eyes of the Lord. That's the Lord that go from righteousness, man. Right. You see right. what I'm saying? Instead of being on the damn block selling drugs and all this oh, shit, you get right. pressed the hell down. You know what I'm saying? You come back, you know what I'm saying, as a common folk, you know what I'm saying? You still blessing all that, yep. but you ain't coming back in that elite seat, you know what I'm yep. saying? As the elect, you know what I'm saying, you know? So we do have to go, you know what I'm saying, Lord, one of come back, you know what I'm saying, receive crowns. That's right. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, the Lord said, you know what I'm saying, the Heavenly Father said, please him, you know what I'm saying, to take Lord Yahweh shot up out yep. here, man, to bruise him, right? You right. know what I'm saying? Yep. yep. We sons too, you know what I'm saying? You got the main son. What about the bird? Yep. And then, and then the bird, you know, that brown bird is spiritual. Somebody was going into that earlier, you know what I'm saying? See a brown bird in, that means protection. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. This chick was going into it earlier, y'all. Wow. I was telling her about the middle. I, um, I told you that bird was in my house when I got home that time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Remember. Yeah, and I told her about it. She was like, oh, what color was the bird? I said, brown. She looked up the brown bird and all that. It went into uh, protection. It went into wow. uh, comfort. You know what I'm saying? It went into uh, like you see a bird or whatever. You know what I'm saying? You know, just things people think of, whatever, just certain things that are written. But it's all spiritual, though. You know what I'm saying? Everything is spiritual. We look at everything from the right hand side. You know what I'm saying? We don't look at things from the left hand side when things happen to us. You know what I'm saying? Right. Certain signs or whatever. We see 144. We don't look at that as negative. You know what I'm saying? Oh, that's positive right there. 777. Oh, it's positive. 555. Five, five. So certain things, you know what I'm saying, that the Lord shows, you know what I'm saying, is um, boost our faith that we already got. You know what I'm saying? We see a chariot. That's to help boost our faith. But we don't need to see it, though. You know what I'm right. saying? But to see it, you know what I'm saying? We, look, yeah. seeing these prophecies come to pass, that's it's boosting our faith, man. It's uh, encouraging our faith. Uh, you know what I mean? Uh, but you got it, bro. Uh, Read that one more time for you, man. You still got it? Oh, I want to say it feeds your spirit. Yep. Yeah. Book of Jonah, chapter 5, verse 17. Right. You want, you want to hear that song again? Yes, yeah, Psalms. Yeah. Psalms. Yeah. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 116, verse 14. Right. I will pay my vows unto Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. The one about, um, that's the one, um, bless, um. This is one line above it. Yeah, just read, just go to the point. Verse 15. Yeah. Precious in the sight of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah is the death of his saints. Right, so if a brother had to go, no saying, look, man, the Lord wanted to have it. It's precious. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Uh, oh, yeah, remember, um, you go to the definition for the word precious, it goes to like priceless. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because remember, he said, I'm going to make one of my men more precious than fine gold. Yeah. You go into that word. Oh, yeah, um, priceless, um, something um, expensive, something that you don't throw away. God. So you're not being thrown away. You know what I'm saying? We have to go. We're not being, our spirit going right back to the Heavenly Father. That's you know right. what I mean? That's definition, you got it, bro. Definition of precious, of great value or See? high price. See? Highly esteemed or cherished. See, you know what I'm saying? You're cherished. You know what I'm saying? In the eyes of the Lord. You get taken out of there, you was one of his cherished. You know what I'm saying? Especially if you get taken out of there doing the right thing. Yep. Brothers, you know what I'm saying? Fearing the Lord throughout the week. You know what I'm saying? Brothers doing what is right, you know what I'm saying? Throughout yep. the week, man. We ain't out here BSing around. You know what I'm saying? We're trying to make our call in the election short. You know what I'm saying? That's why you see us out here week in and week out. Video that we ain't never seen before, you know what I'm saying? That cheers us up. I like, know, yo, right? man, come on, man. Yep. Lord doing his thing, bro. I know, right? Mm -hmm. You got it, bro. The last definition says excessively refined. See? Wow. Fine gold. Yeah, fine gold. Fine gold. gold. The first. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, and it says, says um, an acceptable man in the furnace of adversity. Yep. Yep. All of us being tried. That's just yep. one of your tests. Yep. It's one of your tests. We have to go. That's part of the test. You know what I'm saying? If you go and you finish, you finish. Yep. Yep. The Apostle Paul said, I have finished my work, right? Yep. I have finished my course. Brothers get taken out of here, you finish. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You know? Yep. Your works follow you. You know what I'm saying? Yep. You got it, wrong. It's back to the book of Judah, chapter 5, verse 17. Their God hates wickedness. Dang. And as long as they did not sin against him, they prosper. Yep. Hey, so the enemy knows. The enemy knows that as long as Israel, if Israel being righteous, it's going, and you can't, you can't stop them. Mm. They're gonna be prosperous. You can't, you can't take them down. That's, That's why right. they're throwing that black culture at us. You know, right. Negro, Latino, drugs. Yep, right. drugs. Yeah. You know, they're savages. Uh, using the media to say that, uh, you know, we're we're horrible people. Yep. You know, we're naturally, uh, what what they say, we have a natural low IQ versus all the other nations. They kept constantly pushing us down, man. Mm. Change the faces of the judges. Yep. Yep. Right. yep. The change the faces of the judges. You know. Yep. Oh yeah, they push um, all the different philosophies at us, like um, right. Egyptology. Yep. Which all that if you're not if you don't come in the words of the Bible, it's pretty much everything else is Satanism. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Like Egyptology, that's Satanism. Yep. Uh, Mormonism, Satanism. Satanism. 
fucking believing in Allah, whatever Islam, is that called, Islam, Islam Satanism, Islam, all that Catholicism, Satanism, all that shit is Satanism, man. Yeah. The strategy, you know what I'm saying? Uh, and the other shit that that woman, that's, that's what the woman killed herself for, yeah, right? the, the strategy, yeah. yeah. Strategy. All that shit is uh, wicked. Uh, that shit put a spirit on you, demonic spirit on you, yo. The Lord, you know what I'm saying, gave you over, you know what I'm saying, to them plays, to them demons, yo. You start, you start you bugging yourself out, man. You know what I'm saying? You know, you there is about the end, there is about the end. You do this more wicked shit, bro. You delete your husband, you know what I'm saying? You delete your offsprings, you know what I'm saying? You know, you like, yo, the hell with it, you know what I'm saying? You delete yourself, you know what I'm saying? You see? Because I'm having high level demons on them, yep. legions of demons. It's just only just good. That's why the scripture says, give me any plan but the plan of the heart. You know what I'm yep. saying? Mm -hmm. You don't want the Lord to bug you the hell out, man, because the Lord can't bug you out, yo. The Lord, no said, you remember how the Lord did to um, Nebuchadnezzar and him um, act like yep. a chicken, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Or some beast, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, man. It's like, yo, man. Yeah, the little Lord had talents come out of his fingers and everything. It's man. fearful, man. It's man. a fearful thing. You got it, bro. I appreciate the way you got it. The book Isaiah chapter 30, verse 1. Y'all brothers got something? O to the rebellious children, said the most high, that take counsel, but not of me. Yo, it's different philosophies, yo. you see? I'm deep into everything, man. Yeah. Into that place, plantation Christianity yeah. nonsense. Yeah. They take counsel, but not of the Lord. They're into everything. We just named the shit. Yeah. Egyptology, yeah. Yeah. Scientology. Fucking, uh, what do you say? Uh, um, uh, what do, what do uh, you say, shopper? About that one. Astrology. Astrology yeah. and all that nonsense, man. Yeah. Mormonism. Greek, Greek, Greek uh, customs. Uh, yeah. Astrology. Yep. College ain't nothing wrong, you know. Some bros may go to college, you know, get further there, get a better job or whatever. Trade or yeah, something trade like or something like that. But when you, you know, you basically worshiping college and the the, the culture I'm that comes with it. I'm a cap yeah, I'm yeah. a cap, I'm a Omega Sci Fi, all yeah. that bullshit, man. <laughs> you know, yeah. Say it again. It's Hellenism. Hellenism. That's yeah. right. Yeah. You know, right. and, and, and I think a lot of people involved in that. Yeah. yeah. Brandon they sell. Yeah, Brandon yeah. themselves. Yep. Oh, yeah, that Mason, Mason shit. Yeah. Yeah. Mason, yep. I'm that Mason shit. Yeah. Then you got yeah. the damn awesome women. Brand. You got yeah. the women yeah. in that yeah. shit. The women in um, the yeah. Eastern yeah. Star yeah. shit. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah, then, then, uh, then uh, what's that other one? Uh, Jehovah Wickedness nonsense. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. They, they, take, they take counsel, but not of the Lord. You know what I'm saying? They answer all the other madness that the Lord is pissed off with. Yeah. But, uh, but the scripture just said if, if, if we're doing the right thing, then our power is with us and no one can ever take us down. Right. Right. See, that's why they, everybody's scared now, man. They yep. see it, man. Yes, Wisdom making a person's face to shine, yep. a man's face to shine. Yep. So when we walk into certain venues, it don't matter where we walk into, you know what I'm saying? People are like, yep. motherfucker either move out of there and win everything. Motherfucker be like, yep. we yep. fall no yep. shit. <laughs> like, yo, no, yep. you good, bro. Yep. Cause we humble like that, yo. We ain't coming in no stores proud right. of that. We just come in there regular. If people move out, yo, nah, bro, you good, bro. You know what I'm saying? You know, right. but people, you know what I'm saying, be fucking fumbling, I know, right. falling down and shit. You know what I'm saying? About to fall over shit. Like, yo, yo, bro, you out? We'll help them up, yo. Alright, bro. Yep. Cause people, you know what I'm saying, see something that we don't see. Yep. Like we always tell the bro, when we see brothers, you know what I'm saying? We see brothers, you know what I'm saying? We see, we see little yeah, I was shy. But when these people see us, who knows? They might no. see a person that's probably 4'11. He looks, you know what I'm saying, like 6'7 yep. or something. You know what I'm saying, bro? Spirit. 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 I mean, I don't tell them what they see, man. They see lions walking up in the building, like, yo, you <laughs> know what I mean? Fierce brother got their beard. And it's our countenance, you know what I'm saying? Brothers, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, we ain't smiling too much, you know what I'm right. saying? Uh, Even when we think we smile a little <laughs> bit, the kind of still be kind of fierce, you know what I'm right. saying? So we walk into a place and that mane of a lion there. You see a young lion, you know what I'm saying? In the jungle or whatever, we kind of scared of them. You see, you know what I'm saying, one of them older lions with all yeah. that mane on them. Yeah. yeah, that motherfucker right there, you know what I'm right. saying? Right. So we go on our mane back, you know what I'm saying? This like, because Sleazy want everybody to have no beard on their plain face. Right. He ain't wow. scared of a chick with no hair on his face. You know what I'm saying? Daryl, Daryl, right. get over there and do this, Daryl. You know what I'm saying? But if Daryl had a beard on his face, excuse me, Mr. Daryl. Excuse me, Mr. Daryl. Um, whenever you get a chance, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be, for, I don't know what kind of helicopter that is, but this shit's going to be dropping down from the city soon come too. And then I'm um, army men when we come down off yep. the rope soon come. Yep. You got it, around. Right. So I, I was about to say, I think it's a story where two uh, Israelites went out and the enemies captured them and shaved their beard. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, cut off, cut off um, one side of their yeah, beard. Yeah, yeah. They had to cut their garment, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. They had to show their buttocks, you know what I'm saying? Which brings shame. Because the scripture goes into how we don't supposed to look on another man's nakedness. Right. So, you know what I'm saying? It's a shame, you know what I'm saying? Get your garment, you know what I'm saying? Cut. Yeah. That shows you, you know what I'm saying? Your backside. Yep. And it's a shame, you know what I'm saying? You not have no damn beard, yep. you know what I'm saying? Yep. So when yep. they shave, you know what I'm saying, having the fit, King David like, yo, just stay out of the city, you know what I'm yep. saying, till you grow your beard back. back, you know what I'm saying? They beard grow back, you know what I'm saying, yep. they, they look, come back into the city. Right. You got it. Uh, well, I was watching, uh, you remember when KLC had that uh, offering where 
Shave your beard, you can go get free meal? Yeah, I remember wow. that shit. Wow. You shave wow. your beard, that's how you get a free <laughs> meal. Ain't that some shit? Wow. Look, look, ninja, I don't need a free meal, ninja. I got money, ninja. Yeah. Ain't no free meal, ninja. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If, I, if I need a meal, you know what I'm saying? I call my brother, you know what I'm saying? Yo, bro, I text my brother, bro, you cash at me $20. Right. You know what I'm saying? We don't need, we don't need no handouts right. from nobody, bro. That's why this body is so beautiful, you know what I'm saying? Anybody out here needs some, yo, a phone call or a text, you know what I'm saying? Right. Yo, bro, you know what I'm saying? We ain't gotta make no video. I need help so and so on. Right. We're doing it through text, bro. Right. So no, brother, you know what I'm saying? We ain't gotta get no, we ain't gotta um, record a video say I can't make a video until y'all buy me a camera. <laughs> 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 you record, you making a video. I know, right? Yeah. 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 Come on, man. We're not greedy of gain out here, man. Know, right? What did the Lord say? Um, the scripture say, give me neither poverty nor riches. Yep. We're straight out here, man. Right. You got video with your cash app on right. there. Right. You know what I'm saying? We ain't doing none of that, man. cash app. You know what I mean? If you got um, Israelites out there, you know what I'm saying? Believers or whatever, they might want to throw an offering and things of that nature. Look, man, we ain't really on it like that. You know what I'm saying? Right. We pray on things, you know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, if we do take it, you know what I'm saying? It's going to the rest of the body, you know what I'm saying? Right. Because the brothers out here ain't starving for nothing, man. Everybody out here good, Joe. Get our daily bread, man. The Lord take care of brothers, man. It's yep. beautiful, man. Yep. But if, if a person in the, within the body needs something, though, no, so look. Boom, boom, boom. You know what I'm saying? You know, we'll probably get it for that. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, man, brothers out here taking care of, man. You That's know what we ain't um, um, screaming out cash out, right. V-Moo and all that, right. and all that other stuff, you know what I'm saying? Right. Whatever um, them money platforms, right. people send you money, we ain't on it like that, man. Right. You got it, bro. Mom, you go back to Judah. Yeah, go back, yep, go back to Judah. Book of Judah, chapter 5, yep. verse 18. When, but when they disobeyed him, they suffered heavy losses. Yep. Mm. In many wars, and were finally taken away as captives to a foreign country. Hey, 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 you gotta give it to that, that, that heathen that understood that. He knew the history of Israel. You know, you read Judges, throughout Judges, you know, you, you, what you see? And Israel rebelled, went back to sinning, you know, and Lord put them in, uh, brought a, a nation to, you know, rule over them and take them down. So that he the new, the breakdown of the enemy, which was us. He, he understood that when we were disobedient, we could easily be taken down. Mm -hmm. You got it. The temple of their power was leveled and their cities were occupied by their enemies. Yeah, they see, they knew the history. <laughs> Damn. You know? Yep. You know, that happened in history. You got it. But now that they have returned to their power, mm -hmm. they have come back home from the countries where they have been scattered. And, and how do they know that? Because they see how we were conducting ourselves. Hey. You know, how we were a righteous nation. We were, you know, keeping the laws. And, you know, they understood that. You know, we were, we were uh, you know, not worshiping idols as we once were before. So they see that. Just like they see now. They, they know what's going on. They know who the, and I'm going to say this too, they know who the true prophets are. Mm -hmm. You know, they know who's preaching 100% truth. They know who sold out. You know, they know who took the bag because these elites is the one that's, that's sitting, the, you know, sending that bag out. Yeah. yeah. So they know like, yo, them, them men right there, you can't buy them off. You can't pay them off. And that's why they're afraid that they see the growth of the hopeful elect. You know, mm -hmm. the, 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 uh, the integrity of the true prophets, man. You know, you got it. Yeah, one thing about Sleazy, you know what I'm saying, he got paperwork. Yep. Yeah. Sleazy got paperwork on everything, you know what I'm saying? So you think, come on, man, Sleazy know who took the bag, you know what I'm yep. saying? He got paperwork on it, could go pull it out on them later yep. on. Especially if they go, go to acting up, you yep. know what I'm saying? Try to come out of their face, you know what I'm saying? Right. Try to do this or shit. Nah, man, anytime you did it, that was the name of the Heavenly Father, his only begotten son. We know you took the bag. We know you, you know took the saying? bag. Yeah. Just, I mean, the, the thing about it is priceless. Yeah. So this word is priceless. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you can't sell something that's priceless. Right. You know I'm saying you can't put a help, man. You can't put a what the fuck? Give me a blank check for what? Right. I don't want no fucking blank right. check. You know what I'm saying? I got everything. I got the most expensive thing on the face of the earth. Right. So why the hell I'm gonna give it to you for a couple of thousand or a couple of million? Right. When it's priceless. You know what I'm saying? Right. You can't right. give this away, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? Give this away, you know what I'm saying? And then, then you give me some money. Right. You got it, bro. Hey, Esau wants this. Right. Hey, this is, Esau, if Esau can trade everything to have this, well, we, right. know, we know he's still greedy. Right. <laughs> but he wow. wants this, man. Right. He wants the blessing, man. But it ain't yours. Man. Right. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> And then you can't even sell your soul anyway. The only thing you did is sell your life. Yep. But you can't sell your soul because your soul was already bought with a price right. anyway. So you see guys taking bags, you know what I'm saying, to do it with, with the name of the Heavenly Father and Son and the teachings, you know what I'm saying, of the scriptures. Yeah, yeah, you sold your life. You didn't sell your soul. Yep. Then you got to bend over and do something, that, uh, some degenerate shit, bro. Right. You know what I'm saying? And you got to look in the mirror and shit, yo. Then you got to come, come on, man. You know you did that mind, yo. You know what you did, you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. So you walk around the city or wherever you went, you know what I'm saying? Know that you did some wicked shit, you know what I'm saying? You can't look at these guys probably don't even look in the mirror, bro. You know what I'm saying? Facts. Guys probably don't even look in the mirror, bro. And then the countenance, you know what I'm saying, be like dark too. You know what I'm saying? Like, like
Like the more wisdom you get, the more your face supposed to shine. Mm -hmm. You don't supposed to get more wisdom, and then your countenance get darker, yo. That don't make no sense, right? right. That means you get you get um, some other kind of wisdom. Yeah. Well, uh, which say down um, the knowledge of wickedness, the wisdom of wickedness is not yep. wisdom. Mm -hmm. Some tell it effect. Yep. So now, you no know, saying you didn't gave away the wisdom yep. that makes your face shine. Right. You know what I'm saying? But and then you got the knowledge. You know what I'm saying that makes you look dead. You know what I'm right. saying? Damn. Which is the knowledge of wickedness. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Which is not knowledge. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Well, that's what Satan offered to Yahweh. Yep. Uh, on, on, yeah, on, with the forty days, in, yeah. um, when he was uh, fasting forty days, forty nights, I believe, offered you know, for the whole world. Yeah. Now, Lord, Lord, Lord Yahweh, look, 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 you can't offer me nothing. Right? Everything mine already anyway. Right. So that's, what, that's why we worship the we worship the Creator, not the creature. You know what I'm saying? Right. The creature can't come and tell us shit. You know what I'm saying? Right. We worship the, um, the Creator. You know what I'm right, saying? Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Who's gonna give us all things? You know what I'm saying? Look, freely, we ain't gotta do nothing. You know what I'm saying? But stay faithful. Right. Continue to push the word. You know what I'm saying? It's like, damn, yo, Lord, you have a come back. You know what I'm saying? You made a deal with this damn devil. The Lord destroyed everything. Right. You, you can't even call on nobody for help, yo. I'm saying cannibalism that popped up. You ain't, you ain't got no fucking help doing a race war show, doing a class war, World War Three. You know what I'm saying all that anarchy. You know what I'm saying the, the gender wars. The Lord have a woman, have your woman slice and dice your ass up, yo. You ain't got no protection from that. The spirit's trying to prevent. You ain't got no protection from nothing, man. Earthquakes come. Earthquake, you just sold out, right? But so and when every earthquake come, you know what I'm saying or anything yep. happens, you know I'm saying your ass nerves is saying, yep. you know you ain't got no protection there. Yep. Yeah, you know, Jeebus, 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 ain't real, man. Ain't so you real. can't call on Jeebus, he ain't real. You know what I'm saying? Yo, you can't hide behind your money. You right. know what I'm saying? Because, see, a tornado don't give a damn about no money. You know what I'm saying? An <laughs> earthquake. Right. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, the spirit's created a video. Can't know about no money, man. Yeah, They're on a mission, man. Right. They're here to do a job, man. Yeah, yeah. And you, know, you can't pay the men of the Lord off that to the, the pray for you. Right. you know what I'm pray for you because the Lord said don't pray for them. Yep. Don't lift up a cry for them. That's right. So you sell out, man. You fucked out here, man. Yep. Straight up, man. Sleazy ain't dealing with you no more. Because, nope. look, Sleazy hates a traitor, too. Right. You see? Yeah, he, he liked that you sold out, but he know you a traitor. Yep. He know he know he got to do away with you soon. Come, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yep. You got it wrong. Yeah. Just want to throw that out there uh, for all the sellouts out there. You know what I'm uh -huh. saying? You think you really doing something big? You ain't doing shit, man. You harmed your own self, man. Right. And you put your whole family in danger. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Everybody, yo, your little, your little son, Damn. your young daughter, you know what I'm saying? Or whatever, man. Whole damn family get ravaged, right. bro. And you got to sit there and watch, yo. And you, you gonna call on Jesus? I'm saying this shit is scary too, man. Yep. You got it, bro. You good, you good, bro. It's just like a sellout don't win in the end of the movie. You know what I'm saying? Right. It says, it says righteousness delivered from death. You know what I'm saying? Not selling out. You got it, bro. You got a quick one? Yeah, the back up. Okay, go. I got Nehemiah chapter 9, verse 27. Therefore, thou deliverest them into the hands of their enemies who vexed them, and in the time of their trouble, when they cried unto thee, thou heardest them from heaven, and according to thy manifold mercies, thou gavest them saviors who saved them out of the hand of their enemy. Yeah, you can break it down. Yep. Yeah, so basically, whenever Israel going off, the other nations knew they had a chance to get them. Uh -huh. If we turn, like he, the brother was read, reading in uh, Ju Judah, uh, Judah, Judah, the yep. fifth chapter, Whenever we turn it back to our power, we call it on the true names of the Lord. Yep. They know they can't touch it. That's right. That's right. And that's during the rebuilding of the temple, right? Yes, yes, sir. yes sir. So that was a, the Lord it symbolized a representation of the Lord coming back, mm -hmm. being back uh, with his people, one again with his people. Yes, sir. You know? It's that real coconut. I know, right? Man. 100%. It's that real shit, bro. <laughs> I ain't never tasted no coconut juice like this. Uh, it's yeah, that yeah, real it, it shit. Is, yeah, it is, it's yeah. that real coconut, Joe. You can taste it, man. Hell yeah. Damn. <laughs> come, come. Yep, yep. Hey, we gonna go it don't taste like no other coconut drinks. It's real coconut. Yeah, <laughs> it's not like commercial. I know, right? I know. Somebody did something. <laughs> <laughs> hey, ingredient 100% natural green tender coconut water. See what I'm saying, man, bro? Product of India. Man, man. it's that real shit, bro. Yeah. Uh, that's that shipment. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> supposed to right, you. right, I know, right. <laughs> you brew, you damn brew. <laughs> you bruise. You got it. It's the book of Joel, chapter two, verse twenty-seven. And ye shall know that I am in the midst of Israel, and that I am Yahweh by Shemiah Shai, your power, and none else. Yep, you got it. Right. And this is how the world is knowing that the Lord is in the midst of us, man. These yeah. people ain't, they, they haven't seen, when the last time they seen so-called black men I know, out right? here on the corner with Bibles, man? You know? Not beefing. Not, 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 not beefing. You know what I'm saying? Showing each other love. 
You know yep. what I'm saying? Yep. Us brothers ain't never met each other a day in our lives. Right. Right. You know in this lifetime, right? In this yeah. lifetime. But we come together through the spirit of the Lord. And if I can say to the other tribes too, you got Hispanic, so-called Hispanic, so-called, you know, uh, Latino men, yep. Native American men, you yeah. know, across the four corners of Europe coming together. Yeah. And even though we're not physically, you know, with these brothers overseas and whatnot, we still coming together uh, like mine with the inner spirit, man. Mm -hmm. Preaching 100% truth according to the Bible, showing love to one another, building together. Yep. You know, it's a brother in Finland, Salak in my mm -hmm. you, got, you got, you got. No, I was just saying, it's a brother in Finland mm -hmm. that's bringing the word. Mm -hmm. out. See, a brother in Finland, <laughs> Finland, bro, in Finland. Right. <laughs> what they speak out there? Uh, uh, is it French? over there, Russian. He Russian. Oh, Russian. Russian. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, you know, raising the snow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> over there, in Finland. What? Damn. Damn. <laughs> now, how about that? At all? That's the spiritual body. Yep. Yeah. That's, that's right. That's right. Yep. That's right. Yep. That's yep. So it's not a black thing. Yeah, like exactly. Right. E -H -I -E -H -I. Right. It's not yep. about the color how you look. That's right. So we're going to do away with all that nonsense anyway. Yep. We endure that nonsense. Know right. Saying? That's yeah. something we got to endure too. Yep. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You know what I'm saying? Jake's, you know what I'm saying? It ain't um, Western Snipe complexion and all that. You know what I'm saying? They might look, they might look like an Edomite or whatever. Right. They just got to endure that. You know what I'm saying? So the Lord give them that new body. You yep. know what I'm saying? It's a spirit though, like we read earlier. Mm -hmm. The spirit of a man, not what he look like. Yeah, right. Right. Yeah, yeah. Motherfucker told me I ain't, I ain't black because I'm too light. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this damn woman told me that. Well, you're too light to be black. I said, I mean, you ain't going to entertain that shit. She told me that shit at work. Damn. So you too black. You too light to be black. I said, what is that shit at? I heard it come up with that nonsense, man. We done heard it all, bro. That's that, that, that goes to that motherfucker, um, that, that conscious bullshit. Oh, yeah. That, what did it say? Colorism, too? Yeah, that, uh, you know what I'm saying? Color complex or something yeah. Like that. With the dark, you know what I'm saying, yeah. against the lighter skin yeah. and all that. Yeah, yeah, no, right, right, right. Exactly, bro. <laughs> right. Yeah. You should lighten right. it from Africa. I right. Like, hey, I ain't even to say this shit, man. Like, I'm not going to play that game at work. You know what I'm saying? Nah, man. You got you it. You got it. Man. Right, right. Yeah. You got it, bro. Say that shit at the front desk, too. I'm like, where that shit come from? Right. You know what I'm saying? Yo, the demon just wanted to see if I'm gonna get out of my character. Let me, <laughs> nah, yo. Just the maintenance man. We ain't going poking. there. We ain't going there, yo. <laughs> yeah, you, you always get tested, you know what I'm saying, by those spirits on the right? You stay spiritual. I take that one. Yeah, I'll see, see you ugly ass later, though. You know what I'm saying? That's the only thing I said in my head. I was like, what? I got, I got a precept for that. Yeah. The book of Jeremiah, chapter 17, verse 10. I, Yahweh, by Shimmy Shah, search the heart. Uh -huh. I try the reins, yep. even to give every man according to his ways and according to the fruits of his doings. Mm -hmm. It ain't about the colors, it's about the man's spirit. Yep. It's what he's doing yep. with their spirit. That's right. Mm -hmm. hey, and you got to finish out that uh, Judah for me too when you get a chance. Uh, you, you sure? Yeah. yeah. It's only uh, what, down to 21? Uh, now we're just gonna say all hell brings that ambulance. You know what I'm saying? All hell brings these people walking around like ain't nothing going nothing. on. Everybody all casual. Right. These people gonna be running like hell so Come, it ain't gonna be no phone. So you saw all these people was bugged out for them last couple of weeks. You know what I'm saying? Um, they kept hearing reports of the eclipse going right. yeah. not just service out and was out. A whole lot of people went and bought groceries and everything, bro. Yep. Let's tell you the Walmart something. You know what I'm saying everything is just zooming through, bro. Get get every damn <laughs> thing. Here, um, um, get your waters. You know what I'm saying? Get somewhere to hide. You know what I'm right, saying? Right, right, right. <laughs> Get your, get your, get your, get your bullets. You know what I'm saying? Right. And people fell for that. You see, it's the last day. It's the last day. Um, April the eighth. It's gonna be the last day for Earth. Cause that's what that, um, that woman, um, she was in that. Um, oh yeah, the, the uh, one else, astrology. Yeah, yeah she Worship. thought she thought um, April eighth was gonna be the last day <laughs> that the Earth was gonna be around. You got it, bro. Last day around for Earth. Right, right. That's right. why. That's why I still say trust in the Lord. Don't lean into your own understanding. Right. Right. I got it. Hold on a second, bro. You got a precept. Just backing up what you said. Yeah, yeah. Then we go back. It's the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 1, verse 4. It says, one generation passeth away, and another generation cometh, mm -hmm. but the earth abideth forever. Oh, yeah. That's spirit. We brought that out earlier, yo. Right. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. We wanted to come out twice. Uh -huh. Somebody need to hear it. Yeah. That's right. Earth ain't going nowhere. I know, right? Woo! I know, right? Oh, right. I know it's going to reel to and fro. <laughs> but that goes to show you, it's still going to be here, though. Mm -hmm. it's going to be here, you know? <laughs> I was thinking about that earlier. Yeah, that yeah, was spirit. No, let's finish yours out, bro. Uh, the let's world we made for our sex, we ain't even get to enjoy it yet. I love it. I'm going to destroy it. said that earlier. We ain't get to enjoy it. 40 years. That's all we got. The Lord, I'm 40 years for right now.
but then soon come, it's gonna be up for all eternity. eternity. We're gonna finally get a chance because a lot of us ain't really, really been no too, too much. I mean, yeah, yeah. Jake was like stuck in their cities for a long yeah, time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So on this side, I really ain't been nowhere too much, man. A couple of little states or whatever. But like, I've just been working and grinding. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. Like, yo, that's for right now. So for all eternity, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna be able to travel wherever. That's, that's right. You know what I'm saying? With the brothers yep. and everything, man. It's gonna be beautiful, man. Right. This right. is just part of our story. This is part of our story. You know what I'm saying? Some brothers travel. Yeah. We cross seas and shit like that. Some brother was just stuck, you know what I'm saying, uh -huh. you know, in the rat race. But all of us, you know what I'm saying, gonna be traveling, you know what I'm saying, some come. Yeah, that's some right. different planets and all that, man. Yeah, I got some. The universe is vast, man. Yep. You got it? Uh, uh -huh. Yeah, finish it, yep. This is the book of Judah, chapter 5, verse 20. Sir, if these people are now sinning against their God, even unknowingly, but unknowingly, hey. yep. even unknowingly, and if we can be sure that they are guilty of some offense, yep. we can successfully attack them. So how how, how, how did the enemy know for sure we going off? Man, give them give them this shit right here. Have yep. them worshiping on um, what what Satan or something. Give, give them black culture. Yep. You know, pump it. Yep, yep, pump it in the, in, the, in the TV and the uh, uh, television. Yep. You know, bring it through the school system. Have them going off. Make sure. Tell them it's cool to get tattoos and yep. you know Man. to to, to uh, have you weird hairstyles. Yep. You know, tell them it's cool to sleep with another man's woman. Yeah, send them rappers out there. Hurry up, send them damn rappers. Get R and B singers and tell them to worship the woman. Do all that, man. Make them think the pork is good. Man, right. yeah, no pork is good. Give them Christmas. Right. <laughs> you know, you want to say something? Yeah, like all these different clothes too. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Yeah. So we put pork in our beef, yo. Right. That was, you know what I'm saying, going off unknowingly, bro. And then saying, oh, they eat pork. They eat pork, yeah. You know what I'm yeah. saying? The cues of thy brethren, man. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Sausages, yeah. pork cases. Pork right. cases, yo. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> bro. Yeah. Pork yeah. yeah, you got to read the back of that joint, man. What are you doing with that? Yep. Because I got guys like that. Yeah. Time, yeah. When I was in Same the world. Same <laughs> here. The rest of the I got one to back up. I was going to say. Okay, yeah, okay. Verse 21. But you gonna they, say something about? Say yeah. yeah, I was just speaking about the sausage. They were speaking about, like, especially like when you go to these restaurants. Like, this happened to me when I was in the world. You know, not to speak about myself, but in situations yeah. like, you know, I got like a pasta and it had like the sausage, right? And I asked, you know, at that time, you know, use the wisdom too. I asked, him, I asked the waiter though. I'm like, I was like, hey, what kind of sausage is it? You know what I'm saying? He like it's beef or whatever. Cause I, I I stopped eating pork for a while. Right. And then I started eating it. I'm sitting at the table. You know what I'm saying? I, I, all of a sudden I'm just getting drowsy. Oh, damn. Oh, shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting sleepy. I'm like, yo. Damn. I'm like, yo, this ain't no, this ain't no beef, right? I know, yeah. right, bro. Damn. I'm sitting at the table with my head down. Damn, bro. We had to leave early. Damn. You know what I'm saying? The woman that I was dealing with. She's like, what's wrong? with You good? I'm like, that's pork, man. I'm yeah, like, damn. I told him I don't yep. eat pork. You know yep. what I'm saying? Yeah. I, like I was felt dehydrated yeah, like man, I was about to like, yep. I was like the Lord about to take me out or something. Right, right. <laughs> yeah. yeah man, serious man. And you said something too, made me think about something with Kabad. I was with Kabad one time and uh, I was at uh, some I hop or something like that and um, I wanted like something that it had like sausage in it. I was like, is that turkey? Right. Or is that pork? They was like, no, it's turkey, it's turkey. Yeah. So they sent my plate and I see him in the kitchen looking. I see him on my periphery. I said, I ain't that shit, man. I know, right? I ain't that bro. shit. They looking, never yeah. touched it. But that's going back to the point. You don't right. know what's in your food. But the spirit lets you know, like, yo, don't eat that shit. Yeah. yeah. You ask Bob about that story, man. Yeah. Yo, they have you going off. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Remember, was at a restaurant. They saying they put some bullshit on my plate. And I was like, no, I don't eat that shit. I think they put um, a strip or something on my plate. Yeah. Uh, remember we had oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. a shit. They put a strip or something. I put a couple of them on my plate and shit. I'm like, yo, I don't eat shrimp shit. Here's this motherfucker. So we can just take them off. Nah. No, Fix the whole plate. thing over, yo. <laughs> yeah, the whole yeah. fucking plate. Yeah, I'll yeah. wait. Yeah. I'll wait, yo. <laughs> 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 to a server, you can just take this stuff right, off. Nah, hell nah, 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 nah. Fuck all that, man. Nah, nah, the whole thing. Do the whole plate over, yo. Right. And we ain't been back since. That shit touch my shit, you know what I'm saying? We ain't been back since, yo. And we're good tippers. Right. You go to the restaurant, motherfucker, you're going to get paid that day, you know what I'm saying? You fuck up with one brother. No, none of the other yep. brothers ain't going back. Yo, we did this a lot of restaurants we ain't went back yep. to, yo. Because the one brother said, no, nah, I, I don't like this yeah. shit. But we ain't going back there, right. you know what I'm saying? Right. At least he would get paid. Yep. We're going there every weekend, certain restaurants, yep. yo. He just, I know he was like, damn, yo. I was making damn, you know what I'm saying? At least I'm saying a couple hundred with them coming in there. It's going there deep, yo. Yep. Getting all kind of shit. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Look, uh, customer service, you know what I'm saying? I, I pay whatever for good customer service. I agree. You know what I'm saying? You fix my shit, Yo, real talk. Real talk, bro. Yeah. Yep. Got it. But 
That's what they do to have us go off, man. You know, they have us, you want to say something? Yeah, I was going to say, because even, even when I was in the world, I used to go to Waffle House a lot. And Waffle I, they, 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 they cook, the cook would be up there cooking. Yeah. You know, they cook all that bacon and stuff. I'm like, hey, look, before you cook my food, clean the grill. Like, I know, right, bro? You know what I'm saying? No, no women in the I know, right? I know, man. Pork juice, pork juice all over the place. Yeah, like, don't, don't, don't cook my food up there with that. You know what I'm saying? They didn't think you stupid because you didn't, you don't want to walk. Yeah. Right. Like, Right, right. <laughs> yeah, that's what right. Yeah, that's what you gotta say I'm allergic to it. You crazy? Sure. Yeah. Right, right. You crazy for not eating pork? Right. Right. I know, right? God give the earth. <laughs> <laughs> Other white meat, y'all got it. All right. The book of Judah, chapter seven, verse twenty-one. But if they have not disobeyed the law of their power, then you should leave them alone. Dang. All right. Or right. he will defend them. Damn. Yep. And we will be disgraced before the whole world. And hey, you're going to be put to shame and embarrassed by messing with these people when they're with their power. Yeah. This is the time we're living in with the whole four leg. Yeah. That's why the um, scripture goes into um, 2nd Ezra 16 chapter, how the Lord is going to protect the elect, man. Yeah. You know, then it shall be known who the chosen are. Mm -hmm. Because Lord. the chosen is going to be like unto the you know, Israelites when we were in the land of Goshen. Yep. Yeah. While the Lord is bringing all these plagues, he had the land of Goshen, the Israelites protected. Yep. Yeah. You know? God, you got something? Yeah. It's the book of Psalms chapter... Bring, bring it out now. Be sure. Right. It's the book of Psalms, chapter 34, verse 7. The angel of the Lord encamp yep. around about them that fear him yep. and deliver them. That's that protection, man. You know, the Lord got angels set up that's protecting brothers, man. Believers. Yep. Those of you out here out there believing, you Israelites calling on the true name, sincerely uh -huh. believing this thing. The Lord is sending angels to protect us every day. Mm -hmm. and, and when you wake up in the morning, you pray. We all we got to pray yeah. every day, man. Right. We got to tap into that power source. Brothers mm -hmm. going into power source earlier. You can't truly say you fear the Lord and you ain't praying to him. Right. We need to be doing that constantly, man. Yeah. So the Lord can keep these angels around us, protecting us mm -hmm. and guiding us in the right direction. We want to make sound, wise decisions in these times, man. Yeah. Yeah. We want to remain fervent in this truth, doing the work. You know? What's one of our sins, bro? Your next move could be your last move. Yeah. Yep. Because we don't, want to, we don't want the Lord upset with us, man. I know, right? right? We know how it feels for the Lord to be upset with us, yo. You yeah. get fucked up, man. Yeah, we like, know. God, yo. We know, right? You don't want your father yeah. mad at you, yo. Right. The Instead of um, um, those that fear the Lord would do that, which is well pleasing to him. So we know how to please the Lord according right. to the scriptures. That's right. And the Lord ain't even make it hard either, you know what I'm saying? Uh, brothers, let's go on into your country praying to the Lord to keep the angels, you know what I'm saying, ministry yeah. to you, do the right thing Woo. throughout the week, you know what I'm saying? And pray for ourselves and people. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. yep. And the, yep. Yep. The yep. rest of the elect. Lord, Lord will part of that number. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh. And, and, and you got a bird truck? I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> he got loud, didn't he? I know. He got loud with it. Oh, he right there too. Yep. Preach. Preach. Yep. <laughs> I know, right? That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. <laughs> You say you had a precept? You had one? Okay. Let's get yours, bro. Yeah. Oh, wh whichever one of your brothers. Yep. Okay. This is on uh, the book of Psalms, chapter 81, verse 8. Hear, O my people, and I will testify unto thee, O Israel, if thou wilt hearken unto me. There shall no strange God be in thee, neither shalt thou worship any strange God. And that's a commandment from the Lord. You know, we're not supposed to be worshiping any idols, you know. Any, any of these idols are being pumped and pushed in, in Babylon the Great. There's an idol for every day, man. Yeah. You know, the only true and living power that there is is your how about shimmy how about shy. That's these, right. These idols that have your ass getting uh, put to deletion. Mm -hmm. You know, hey, JC is the biggest idol that got our people messed up in the head, man. Yep. You know? I am the Lord thy power, which brought thee out of the land of Egypt. Yep. Open thy mouth wide, and I will fill it. Yeah, hey, look, the Lord is the one that brought us out of the land of Egypt. Lord, the Lord constantly reminds us of that too, as He should. Yeah. You know, He was the one that brought us out. You know, we just came out of a Passover. What a month? What, what about a month ago? Time going fast. Yeah, time going fast. Three mm -hmm. weeks ago. You know, the Lord. Hey, what, was that a reminder? See, these high holy days, these 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 uh, you know days that we celebrate and worship Yahweh by Shemuel Shai and keep them is a reminding of, of what the Lord did for us. It's edification behind all that. Mm -hmm. yeah. To help us remember, remind us why it's so important to continue to uh, worship the Lord. He's the one who brought us out of the land of Egypt. Yeah. The bridge collapsed right after that. Uh-huh. The bridge, right, right after that. Right oh, yeah, yeah, the bridge, yeah, that was a, yeah, yep. Mm -hmm. 
And a whole lot of other bridges was collapsing. Yep. Yeah, a couple of them. They went in um, Tokyo, I think. Somebody Tokyo, and there was a bridge on fire in, um, in Ohio, I believe. Yep. Yeah, China, 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 too. China, 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 yeah. China, yeah. Oh, shit. Earthquakes. Yeah. That was earthquake, uh, earthquake in Richmond. I felt that bad boy, too. Yeah. Yeah, man. They said when an earthquake comes, they'll say, don't run outside. Get up on the table. Oh, um, the elder brother from Watson, you know what I'm saying, from um, L.A., the head brother. See, we, we don't, they don't train us over here in the East Coast for earthquakes, yeah. but this is a diverse place, you know what I'm yeah. saying? But over there, they train them for earthquakes. They say when an earthquake happens, don't run outside. So get up under the, um, a stable table, on a coffee table or something. They can withstand something fall on top of it. Yeah. Get up under that, you know what I'm saying? Just hold on to the legs. we we'll either hold on to the door, yeah. the door frame yeah. or the door, you know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Stop the shit. He said the worst thing is to run outside, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Your shit falling down, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Stay inside, you know what I'm saying? When everything stops shaking, then come outside, you know what I'm saying? Unless, unless you stay in the house and it's nothing but a damn field, right. it's not going outside, you know what I'm saying? Right. Then you can run outside. It's nothing but field, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Ain't nothing going to fall on you. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But then you got to worry about the ground opening. Yeah, I was yep. saying, yep. I was yep. thinking, yep. as I was saying that, yep. I was thinking yep. that too. Yep. Hey, well, it's your time to go. You, you, you think right. you getting away from one thing. Right. That's why it's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of little power, man. Yep. You know, like, or you think you're going to get away from falling <laughs> over the ground. Right, right, right. right. Shit. See that one dude, he was sleeping in his damn bed. I did an end of news on him um, several months ago. He was sleeping in his bed. That's thing you know, the ground opened up and swallowed him and the bed. Damn. Hey, look, they said, they said uh, the bed and him went so far in the damn hole, they couldn't even find him, bro. They said, we're not even going to try to go look for him, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The, the hole opened up that big, bro, yep. to where him and the bed went down in the hole. The hole was so damn deep. They're like, nah, I think the, uh, the hole, uh, the, they, they really don't know how, how far it went, but they said it released 100 feet. Yeah. They said we're not going down there. They said we're not going down. It's not even safe to go down there. <laughs> bro, she crazy, bro. Like, shit, no say that down. Um, the people celebrate Easter. No saying the damn bus went off the damn cliff. Oh yeah, 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 right. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. all yeah, that, bro. Yeah, forty-five people. What they? Yeah, and one person Easter. got one person lived was a little baby to live. Yes. Said, yeah. Wow. Yep. I did the interview news on. It. I typed it in. Yo, the bus was fucking crushed, bro. Damn. Whoa. Man, that, that um, that um, <laughs> Hebrews ten and thirty one is for real, yo. For real, bro. It's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of little power. Man, that shit crush, man. man. Is that the, in the news when the, the power, the power box fell on the car? That's you did one on that one. No, nah, that was a different one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, the one when that shit got shot, right? <coughs> yeah, that woman and that dude all of them got shot up in that motherfucker, yo. <laughs> and her damn son. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> damn. Dang, that's crazy, bro. With the bathroom, bro? Yep, yep. Um, yeah, yep. Verse 11. But my people would not hearken to my voice, mm -hmm. and Israel would none of me. Yep, uh, majority of our people, they, you see that happening now. They're not hearkening to the voice of the Lord. Now, what's the voice of the Lord? The prophets. The Lord speaks through his prophets. You know? Can I just say one thing, Rob? That's black empowerment. Right. <laughs> right yeah. They did all that, bro, just to be able to do that right there. They did all this marching, stomping, holding up signs. Just, just walk through dressed like that, bro. Wait, That's wait, freedom, right? Tight yeah. Yeah. That's freedom. <laughs> bro, they call that freedom, right? Right. Bro? Being and walking around like whores, right, bro? <laughs> when it's a shame to be, be seen like that. Mm -hmm. All bodies in the girl. They got to the pay for that shit, so I'm coming mm -hmm. up, bro. Did all that shit, bro. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yep. When the court all them time, you know what I'm saying, fighting for rights and shit, this would be like that, bro. That's, that's Eve, though, right? That's Eve, right? Eve, Eve. Eve, Eve. Gotcha. Yep. So I gave them up. Unto their own hearts. Yep, so the Lord gave them up to their own hearts, their own mind. You know, and, and, and look, the brother quoted earlier, lean not to your own understanding. Mm -hmm. Our people started worshiping idols, you know, uh, thinking that the Lord wasn't going to uh, destroy them for that. And eventually destruction came. You know, uh, you can get 2nd Ezra 7 and, uh, what is it, uh, many shall perish. 20. 7 and 24 out of Rome. That one. Oh, no, no. Bring, bring yours out, bro. I just got one sentence. Okay, yeah, bring yours out. And they walked in their own counsel. So they walked in their own counsel. Right. Rather than taking heed to the counsel of the Lord, which he, he's speaking through his men. Yeah. And so what comes behind that is deletions. Order is being set up regardless if you like it or not. Yeah. And behind the order, is, what do you do when you clean up a crib? You throw away all the shit you don't need. Yeah. Lord throwing away, just to get in order, he's cleaning up the nation of Israel. And, and you know, these heathens are getting in check. Because he's getting ready, he's setting up order before our eyes, man. We got a free stop. Let's bring this brother right uh, here and then we'll get you. Yeah, it's you. Is this the book of 
Baruch chapter 4 verse 25. My children, suffer patiently the wrath that has come upon you from the Most High. Yeah, so the, the wrath the Lord brought upon us is for our, our, our wrong doings, man. You know, the, the, all the plagues you read about in Deuteronomy. Yeah, I want to show right now. Shalom, so my brother. Shalom, bro. Good seeing you, bro. You see, my brother, always. So the Lord brought all this upon us, man, because we weren't hearkening to his counsel. We all we all fell out. That's why the Lord told Jeremiah, you're going to be discontinued from your, your nationality, your heritage. He did this to us, man, yeah. for our wrongdoings. You got it. For thy enemy have persecuted thee, but shortly thou shalt see his destruction and shall tread upon his neck. Hey, and we and we know that, Shalom, bro, and we know that one of the signs of that was the solar eclipse. Yep. Is, uh, look, the scriptures say, Lord, you're going to see signs in heaven. Yep. You're going to see fearful sights, all these different things. To know that shortly the Lord is getting ready to come back and destroy our enemies, man. All right. Even though we went off, the Lord's having mercy on us again. Yep. Yep. So these heathens going traveling miles and miles and getting these solar solar shades, don't even realize they looking at their demise. They just, right. Oh, right. Wow. Right. Yeah, yeah. The Lord you ready to destroy your ass, man. Yeah. Hey, bro, and you have people out there asking on the day of the eclipse. They out there have, getting married and yeah. everything. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? Screaming like, and hollering. Yep. And they're crying and everything, yep. bro. Yeah, bro. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. This way it came. It came. Right. I'm like. Like, like, the Lord really got them in a trip, man. Because they talking about year 2044. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. ain't seeing that. I know. <laughs> in the kingdom. All right. <laughs> I know, right? You know what I'm saying? Yep. My delicate yes. ones have gone rough ways. Mm hmm. And we're taken away as a flock caught of enemies. Yep, yep. And we were, we were, uh, we were uh, sent over to our enemies. The Lord gave us up for our ruins to our enemies. Be of good comfort, O my children, and cry unto the Most High. And cry, lament unto Yahweh by Shem Yahushai. The Lord gave us the names back to do that. All right. So that's what we're doing, those of us in the hopeful elect, man. We're lamenting, we're praying for the Lord to destroy this place. And, and Lord willing, we get salvation. Yeah. You know? For ye shall be remembered of him that brought these things upon you. Wow, man. So the Lord remembers us, man. All right. And that's, yo, man, that's a humbling thing. The Lord remembers his people. Yeah. But here's the thing. The Lord's not saving all Israel this, on, on this side this time around. So it makes it even scarier to, yeah. to, to think about, ponder, and consider. Hey, man, that the Lord's only saving the elect. And that's a remnant. That's a small number compared to the ones he's destroying. You know, so it makes you realize how important it is to, to really be in order. And mm -hmm. seek the ways of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, crying unto him. Yeah. Uh, I'm not wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong. They're, um, they're one third of the majority coming out of America, right? Yep, yep. That's yep. even more scary. Yep, I <laughs> know, right? Scary, bro. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Be a good comfort on my children and cry unto the Most High, for ye shall be remembered of him of that brought these things upon you. For as it was your mind to go astray from the Most High, yep. so being returned, seek him ten times more. Yep. And, and ten goes to what? Uh, uh, perfection. perfection. So we, we, we try our best, man, perfect, to, to seek the Lord in perfection, man. Mm -hmm. you know, we know we ain't perfect, but we strive for perfection. Yeah. Right. You know, and this is a, a, a very delicate, serious time to use this time wisely, you know, and, and redeem these times. Use it as an opportunity to really step up and put, put forth your best effort. You know, you, you, we all know that our efforts can be better in certain areas. You know, we try. We in the flesh. But that's how important it is to seek the Lord ten times harder. You know? Uh, let's bring the brothers to precept and we'll go to the slide. Okay, this is Proverbs 22 and 3. A prudent man foreseeth the evil and hideth himself. A wise man, he sees evil, is here, and he hides himself. How do you hide yourself in his word? He has foresight to see the evil's coming. Let me let me hide my, myself. And so that's what we're doing. Because remember, we're likening it to Watchmen. The Watchmen sees what's going on. He, he has a, a favorable position. He can see far out. And he, he hides himself in his word and, and, and warning while warning the other people. You know, that's, that's that prudent, wise man. You got it. But the simple pass it on and are punished. But the simple worrying about the, the 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 rap battle between J. Cole and damn uh, Kendrick Lamar. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, they they worrying about uh, uh, Caitlyn Clark shooting threes. Oh, J. Cole, you let us down. You let us down. <laughs> and I tell you how messed up the world is when you when you that's his, his so called brother, right? right? He apologized to his brother, but the world like, why you do that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, why you do that? You never apologize. Right. right. They want they want you to sacrifice your peace.
with their entertainment. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like, who is going to right. uh, LeBron, uh, uh, MJ, or Kobe? Right. Like, that's another thing. Uh, right. Uh-huh. It's funny you said that because, to be honest, he didn't even want to make that song. Yep. I, and I was thinking about it. I was like, he, but he made it so quick, he didn't want to make it. He just felt obligated to make it because the world the was world, yep. too. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, what you going to do? What well, you yeah, gonna that, do? that peer pressure that shit. That peer yeah. pressure, yep. Yeah. I said, we don't fall for that don't shit. Fall for that. Don't give a damn about no peer pressure. Right. We, we don't care about the standards of the world. Yeah. Like we really despise and hate this world. Yeah. Yep. We don't give a damn about it. We don't want to be. We don't want to fit in. We don't care about being a part of the cool crowd. Right. You know, the Lord, the, the, not the Lord, slap you. The world will pretend like it loves you, yep. and then just use your ass and just kick you in the yep. back, stab you in the back, man. Mm-hmm. 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 Chapter 12. Once he have, once he have no longer need to be, he throw you away. Throw you away. Cash yep. you out. Yep. Well, I was gonna say, the world shit for you one minute, and then they shit on you in the next yep. breath. Yep. And it, yeah, it makes more sense now why the Lord said be tempered in all things. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Don't use this world. Don't abuse this world. Yep. Cause they, cause you start being around, they start thinking they get familiar with yep. you. Yep. But they get comfortable around you, like nah. Like that's how I used to do. Used to yeah, first thing my father said, oh yeah, he ain't going, he ain't battling him. I ain't going to his show. Yep. You lose ticket sales and everything. Yep. I ain't proud of Joe. I thought he was proud of Joe. I thought he was going to represent the country, yo. I thought that shit go, bro. <laughs> See, that's that black culture. Yeah, man. No that black culture is some bullshit, man. My mother said, fuck, they'll cheer for you. They'll say, fuck, they'll yeah. say, bro. Turn on you in a minute. Right. Yeah. Yeah, so Lizzo, Lizzo, they made all these big girls come out showing their stomachs. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just come out, just be showing their stomachs. They be big as hell, right? And the man got to roll with them, right? Body positivity. You know the one, you know the big girl. Not, 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 not against the big girls. And nothing against the big Shirley's. But you know if you with a big Shirley, if you don't go out with her, she don't say she ain't gonna buy you shoes. Oh, yeah, I know, right? You know what I'm saying? Right. Come so get her, and then she get you everything you want for the grocery store. Right. You gotta come with her, though. Right. right. You get, she, she gonna give you some of that tax money. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You gotta come with her. Style, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. You want anything, you got to be seen in public with them. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm going to go to the grocery store. You want anything? Yeah, I'll take something. Come on with me. I'm going to hop your ass up. Because everybody's going to get y'all funny. But when you get to the crib, she's going to take good care of you. Hell yeah. She's going to buy you everything you want. It's going to be yeah. expensive steaks. Hell she's yeah. She's going to get you no know, shit, man. <laughs> right. I know, right? <laughs> when you get a big shirt, just know you got to be out there with her. <laughs> You got a sport, you got a sport. You know? yeah. I know, right? Right. right. Yeah, yeah. yeah but a good stuff. <laughs> bro, you better do something, you know what I'm saying? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, what? You see that one coming in. Did you see? <laughs> <laughs> what did I say? Did you see? <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, 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 I can't lie. I see it. <laughs> I'm like, man. I see the two blocks on there. I see that. <laughs> You gotta let them come up with their stomachs out of there. I know, right? You gotta tell them they look good. Yep. I look good? Yeah, girl, you look good. You look good. You gotta pause them, you gotta hold their hands. Hell yeah. You gotta smack them with their hands. (laughs) Y'all got it. You got that lamentation, you got one. Con, con. This this book of Second Chronicles, chapter 15, verse 13, that, that whosoever would not seek the Lord power of Israel should be put to death, whether small or great, whether man or woman. We got it, brother. All right, that's referring to the Israelites, man. Yo. You know, y'all ain't seeking the God of the Bible. Yeah, how about you now, Shai? Yo. It's deletion, man. Mm-hmm. The Lord ain't about to spare none of our people that's not seeking Him right. in these times, man. You see what's going on in the, our people. Uh-huh. See what's going on in the world. Like this man, the Lord is shaking shit up, man. I know, excuse right? My, excuse my expression. Uh huh. Hey, there's a dude that said just um this was a dude that just um, deleted nine people. I think twelve got injured, yeah. or he did deleted six people. Twelve got injured. I'm saying this was um I, I did it in the news this morning. So either happened yesterday or early yeah, this yeah. morning. Yeah, dude, you no know saying deleted six people. Yo, look, 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 look. He deleted all the people. He injured like twelve people. I'm like ninja. If you no know saying we out here and right. one, one dude come up and stab one brother, this I'm motherfucker not out of here. Right. Yeah. He's not gonna get a chance to do all right. of this. Right. But you know what it they is? All the people, bro. You got it, bro. Oh, got they on the phone. Yeah, yeah, right. They on the phone recording. Oh, this shit crazy, bro. They, they forgot about survival mode. Yeah. They too busy. Keep the snitch up. Hit the snitch in the head right. with something. You know what I'm saying? Some. Give them uh, bikes and shit. Throw that damn bike on the I know, right? Son. Did you hear about the, the um, I think it was a Jake that uh, deleted them people and left a note Why he deleted each Oh, yeah, one. no, say, yeah, bro. Yeah. He decapitated one of them real bad. Damn. And all the rest of them. I, I, I think, um, didn't he um, cut off all the hands? 
I think he took off their hands. They was all over in the car. He left, he, left, he left a note in everybody's hand. He said everybody's hand, it was either him or either their jacket pocket or something. Everybody had a note on the reason why they got deleted. Yeah, it was in Mexico. Yeah. Yeah. He had a note for everybody he deleted, so the reason why he did it, Real, yo. That's a spirit fate of a business, yo. Yeah, real talk, bro. <laughs> That's why if you ain't seeking the Lord, he got a spirit fate of a business already ready for you, man. Yep. And he said it's, it's, it's gonna come upon you um you disrespect yep. suddenly, yo. Yep. And he said nobody can't deliver you out of his hand either. Right. She was a spirit creator in Venice. Now that she finished the one with the Sony clip thing, yeah, yeah, yeah. And as soon as you know what I'm saying, she deleted everybody that she's supposed to have deleted. I'm saying the Lord had ended up deleting her. You know what I'm saying? Yep. And That's crazy, bro. Yeah. Yep. Oh yeah. Um, um, one of her offspring lived though. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah, she had two of them. She threw both of them out on the bell line. Yeah. 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 Um, I think the four month or some year old. You know what I'm saying? Month old. I think it was deleted. But then there was another one they did get deleted. Dang. Like yeah. They're gonna be getting rabbits. Yeah, you got a shop. Yeah, probably you got it. Check with you, brother. Bring it out. Bring it out. Ezekiel chapter 36, verse 16. Moreover, the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, the Son of man, when the house of Israel dwelt in their own land, they devout it by their own way mm -hmm. and by their doings. Their way was before me as an uncleanness of a removed woman. Hey, mm. the foul the foul bodies idols. Yeah. Yep, yep. The foul bodies idols taking on the, you know, the the ways of these idols. These heathen nations. And there's a scripture I think in, in Jeremiah six and two um, about taking it back a woman who uh, committed adultery. Yeah, it's it's similar to the Lord taking us back. Right. Yeah. I yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like an unclean woman, you know, a defiled woman. You know, who went whoring after another man. That's how Israel was, Amen. you know, uh, with these idols. Yeah, I think it's six and two. Jeremiah six and two. Three. Oh, three. You got it? Or is it three? This is Jeremiah six and two. I have liked the daughters of oh, Zion yeah, yeah, yeah. to a comely and delicate woman. Uh huh. Or oh, which one? Yeah, yeah, that's it, that's it, yep. So the Lord is like Israel to a, a, comely, a comely and delicate woman, mm -hmm. a beautiful and delicate woman. Now, we know we all have women now. If your woman go and step out on you, she's unclean, she's defiled. You don't want to take that woman back. Got her abroad. Yeah, what our brother's getting it, nevertheless, the Lord is comparing Israel uh, to, uh, to a woman. Yeah. You know, and we, again, going through experience of your woman, you, you know, your woman step out, that's the ultimate dis disrespectful thing you can do. So our people, our people have gone after these idols, which is likened to a woman. Yeah. JC, we're talking about Islam, Buddhism. You got Jake, all, and, and all of these types of, uh, you know, idol worshiping. Rastafarian. You know, instead of the true living power, which, you know, is Yahweh Bashim Yahweh the world ignorantly calls God and Jesus. So now the Lord brings us back to our heritage and who we are. Now we, we, we have to come back to being that comely and delicate woman. But that takes the Lord, you know, being humble and submit to the Lord in order to do that. You gotta be submissive too. Submissive, yep. That's right. Judges chapter 10, verse 13. Yet ye have forsaken me, they serve other gods. Yep. Wherefore I will deliver you no more. Yep. Go and cry unto the gods which ye have chosen. Yep. Let them deliver you in the time of 
y'all tribulation. So your woman committed adultery. Now, now she she hurting. She's struggling. She's coming back. Nah, go to that nigga. You know what's fucking with you. What it say? She belongs to the streets. And then the streets devouring them, exactly. aka us, no saying right. being devoured, no saying by these heathens yep. and going through this hell. Yep. And then we're seeking the Lord now, no saying? Mm -hmm. Then you're seeking your husband now. Yep. That you went against. Yep. The thing about the Lord, He's forgiving us for that, right. you know what I'm saying? Yep. We can't and, thank the Lord enough, man. That's mercy, bro. You know what I'm yeah, like, man. Not, the, the average man ain't taking a woman. Yeah, back yeah, step, yeah. Nope. No, that's hard to do. Blocking and everything. Yeah, right. Right. Blocking and numbing everything. Bro, blocking and numbing. You know. Ignoring her. Yeah. Real talk. That's, that's the ultimate disrespect. But the Lord said he engraved us on the palm of his hand. Mm. Right. So, hey, right. uh, mother might forget her child. Yeah. Why they, they haven't forgotten you? That's right. That's right. Yeah. Yeah, get that, Jeremiah. It's the book of Jeremiah, chapter 3, verse yeah. 1. Says, no, yeah, they, uh, <laughs> um, yeah. 3, verse 1. It says, they say, if a man put away his wife, mm -hmm. and she go from him, yep. and become another man's, Shall he return to her again? Shall he? Re shall she return him to him again? Of course, we know the answer to that. No, right? She went and committed adultery. She go and you got it. it. Says, shall not that land be greatly polluted? Shall not that land be greatly polluted? Another man went into her. Oh, yeah. She's she's defiled, you know. And and I, the nation of Israel has been the same way by going after these idols, been defiled. But we have a shy who the world ignorantly calls Jesus. We are made clean again, you know. Says, it's like you got a sandwich, no saying you just made a good sandwich, no saying. I say you know you go to the bathroom, you come back somebody and bid on it. You don't want that sandwich. Yeah, this is like this is like somebody messing with your woman, you know what I'm saying? Right. You don't want that sandwich. Look, you might want to take that sandwich. Right. Right? You didn't bid into it. Right. Yeah. Just giving an, uh, an analogy. Uh, beautiful. It says, it says, shall not that land be greatly polluted? But thou hast played the harlot with many lovers. Harlot is, a, is what, a prostitute? Yeah. And to many lovers have, have horned after these different idols. Many idols, man. Many. And to this day, you know, they got idols that, that, that uh, Jake is into, witchcraft, yeah. you know, that, that we don't even know about. The worshiping the dead, yeah. digging up the dead to worship yeah. the dead. Yeah. Right. You know? They actually do that? Yeah, they do that. A lot of um, those Latin tribes. Yeah, what's they do that. Single to my, oh, I don't know, single to my. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't know that was dead. Dead, dead, dead. Dead, 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 okay. Yeah, and then go right back into um, the prophet Sam. When that witch brought Sam back. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, yep, okay. They're still doing that to this day. Uh, okay. You saw what King Saul was doing, we have the King Saul for doing it, right? He got put to flight. Yep. You're supposed to go to no wish, no saying to summon up no spirit. Right. Lord, take you up out of here. That spirit is at rest. Yep. That's what you ever say? Yeah. 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 The Lord ain't dealing with you. What make you think I can know saying? I know, right? The Lord won't answer you. What make you think I can make him know saying? Peace. Right. And then you went to go commit more wickedness trying to find a way back. He ignored me. He ignored me. All right, all right. Yeah, he's ignoring you, motherfucker. Right. I ain't got nothing to do with it. Right. And you think this going to help your cause? Right. What you doing right here? Right. <laughs> Chris, you happy as hell, ain't you? I know, right? You see his mouth. Chris yeah. said like this, Chris said like this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, right, back up, right? Y'all got it. You finished yours? It's just a little bit. Oh, okay. It says, yet return again to me. We'll said, do 15 more minutes and then we're going to wrap. It says, yet return again to me, said Yeah, return back, you know? Return Both back. of y'all on camera, Steve? Uh, yep, yep. Return back, man. That's what we're doing. Mm -hmm. You know, we're trying to be like that comely and delicate woman, man. You know, into the Lord and, and submitting to the Lord yep. to the best of our ability. Right. You know, um, you got to let, let a brother bring his, and then we'll go to you. Oh, y'all, yeah, okay. Okay, God. This uh, Ezekiel chapter thirty-six, um, verse eighteen. Wherefore I pour my fury upon them for the blood that they have shed upon the land, mm -hmm. and for their idols wherewith they have polluted it. Yep. And I scattered them among the heathen, yep. and they were dispersed through the countries. Yep, and that's the scattering that, that actually took place in these times too. You know, uh, when we went into captivity, you know, the Lord destroyed us and, and dispersed us amongst these heathen nations. We took yep. on the idols. You got Jake all over the world, man. You know, uh, uh, whether they know the Israelites or not, through the scattering uh, and the curses that the Lord put upon us. And then bring, somebody bring the other scripture where it says uh, we're going to have no ease. Money, yeah, Deuteronomy, the 20th chapter. Yeah. 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 Ye
trying to bring that out. It's going into like, like when we were scattered, you know what I'm saying? Shit, man, we were scattered to, around either that never loved us, yep. never cared about us. Yep. So, of course, when we got scattered, we're going to be in the, um, the worst part of the land. Facts. Everywhere we scattered, yo, Jake fucking got um, Jake that look like Dahe East Indians uh -huh. in the worst part of that land. Yep. And so far, we saw him, man. Yep. It says, it says we, we ain't going to find no ease, man. Mm -hmm. Okay. Remember the brother, um, the elder brother, um, Ash, you know what I'm saying, came from Jamaica. He said, you know what I'm saying, the goose over there running Jamaica and shit. Wow. He said, he said, you know what I'm saying, um, yeah, you won't hear shit. Me and Kabal was talking to him. He said, you know what I'm saying, when you walk into the stores over there, it's the goose over there running the store and yep. shit, right? You walk in the store and shit, the damn goop, you know what I'm saying, you in Jamaica and shit, yep. right? But it's a goop, you know what I'm saying, running the shit, right? Yep. He look at you all crazy, like, yo, what are you doing in my store? I know you can't afford it. Damn. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So no goops, you know what I'm saying, no matter where we at. So Jake, just because Jake, you know what I'm saying, is in a certain area or a certain yep. land, that mean they running shit. Right, right. Yeah, the, 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 the Mexicans, they can't be here. It's like they got their own win. They, they down there running that shit. shit. So they got a fucking puppet leader and all right. that shit. Yo, man. That's facts. They got a beach in Jamaica where the Jamaicans can't even Yeah, see what I'm saying? Yeah. 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 So we ain't finding no ease, bro. You <laughs> know what I'm saying? Yeah. Service down there, bro. Scattered, man. Especially South America. They, they, that, they using everything from the fruits, the pork. They eat all this stuff. They don't give people nothing. Yup. Give them a little pet. I'll pay them like peasants and shit. Yeah. Right. And then I was thinking about it earlier, you know what I'm saying? Well, earlier this week when I was at work and shit, the Lord was like, yo, there's some people, you know what I'm saying, in America right now, they don't even know that slavery ended. Right. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah, man. Real talk. So many damn towns, you know what I'm Real saying, talk, that, we, yep. that nobody don't really know about where you got jinx still on a damn plantation. So yep. hardcore slavery, bro. Yep. They don't even know the slavery uh, fucking so so called yeah. been over. They don't even know motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying, out That's here, you know what I'm saying, drip preaching the word. And, you know what I mean? So called freedom, got their own apartments and all that. Yeah, man. We oh, seen movies real. like that, yo. Yep, yep. And the story's been told like that, yep. man. There's Jake's right now that's in slavery, yo. Yep. Like there was, you know what I'm saying, in the 1930s and 20s and shit, bro. That's real Only damn plantation. It's covered by woods and yep. all that shit, yo. Yeah. You got it, bro. Like, I feel like that when I went to uh, Charlottesville to visit the Monticello. Um, oh, yeah, you told me yeah, about it. Yeah, when I went over there, it yeah. felt like something out of a, a Jordan Peele movie. Damn. When I was, the hotel I was staying in, they looking at me like, because I was the only Jake in there. They looked yeah. like the fuck? Felt like I was in Get Out. Right. Damn, you know it's two sundown towns. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Yep. yep. This is the land of the free, though, right? right. Well, you can go. You just got to be out of there for the sun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All ass. Cause that what that um that it was like women said she went down there no saying the, the, um you know how they do them sales shit yeah, you, know yeah, yep. you got to go from house to house or whatever yep. said certain certain houses had them Confederate flags and yeah. people was letting them know no saying get out there it was like nigga get out of my yard nigga and all that right she felt like no said she said she was fearful for her life she said she was scared she said she had to help him get the hell up out of there she was like why are people acting like this she's like yo these are them sundown towns yep. she's like yo why the hell y'all bring me here then you know what I'm saying right. Jesus Christ. So we already know it's, it's um, towns out there, probably in Mississippi, yep. you know what I'm saying? Even in North Carolina. Yep. North Carolina, yep. big as yep. shit, man. Yep. That's the place in North Carolina we don't even know about, yo. Yeah. In the fucking the darkness, you know what I'm saying? They got a Jake, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Jake ain't Jake, ain't, Jake probably don't even know it's, it's such thing as cell phones, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And all that shit. Jake got probably, yeah. yeah that's real. On a slave plantation? Probably still getting beat and shit, you know what I'm saying? Calling them boy and all that. The women too, you know what I'm saying? Like Aunt your mama shit. Yeah. This shit going on right now. And, and the Lord said, you know what I'm saying? Miserable are the cities that thou serve. Mm -hmm. So he dealt with how to pay for everything they did to us, bro. Mm -hmm. Yo. Hey. It's like you chime on what you just said. Uh, even with the elites in their underground cities and their secret cities, they probably still got Jake's in, in Yeah, you know they too. do, man. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Well, they might not be in chains, you know what I'm saying? But they working like hell. Oh, yeah. Damn it for yeah, free. Yeah. And they can't leave or nothing. Yeah. Well, they might got chains on them. I can't say. What year was Katrina? Uh, 2000. Yeah, okay. 05. Yeah, 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 Life. Yeah, right. look, look, that, that's in the 20th century. Yep. We don't serve your country. Right. Right. We don't serve them. Hey. Uh, one of your brothers reading the precept? I, I had some. Okay. You know, okay. Second, seven, no, okay. 20. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's the book of 2nd Ezra, chapter 7, verse 20. It says, For there be many that perish in this life because they despise the law of the Heavenly Father. That is set before them. Yeah, the Lord is cleaning up the earth. Yeah. So the ones of our people who don't want to serve the Lord and submit, the Lord is going to lead you. And that's that's going to set a order in itself. So we'll come back to the kingdom in order. Yep. Yeah. That point blank period. But it's going to be a lot of 
Israelites get from the deletion. What the heathen shall want? Y'all about to start my stock. Come on, bro. Come on. Let me see. Come on. Come bro. You got to keep on. It says, For Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai have given straight commandment yep. to such as Cain yep. what they should do to live. Yep. Don't, don't eat certain food. Don't worship idols, period. Love your brother. You know, don't steal. Right. Don't sleep with the next man's woman. Right. You women, be in order. Submit to your man. Right. Right. All these basic, straight to the point right. commandments. Yep. But it's grievous to the people that uh, they forsook the way, yep. though. As like the scriptures have said, right. correction is grievous to those that forsook the way, and he or she that hated reproof shall eventually get deleted. Yep. Facts. Lord ain't gonna keep warning our people either. I'm saying the one of the law most over, this is gonna be just straight up destruction. Hell yeah. Don't come looking for the prophets of the Lord. They gave you one and already. The, 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 uh, the tongue yeah. of the prophets is gonna cling to the roof of their mouth so yep. come. There ain't gonna be no one. You can see that fast approaching, bro. I know, right. Yeah. The devil's you no know, saying past the laws already to so where you can't preach the Bible in certain yep. states and countries and things of that nature. Yep. So soon come you think it ain't gonna hit Raleigh, North Carolina. I know. Think right. it ain't gonna hit Ghana, North Carolina. Mm -hmm. Think it ain't gonna hit you no know, saying New York and shit like that. It's gonna hit all these cities and towns, man. Yep. Jackson, Mississippi. The prophets are not gonna be on the streets anymore. That's right. But then you're gonna have them false prophets, you know what I'm saying, try to be, you know what I'm saying, thug and revenge right. and shit. And they're yeah. gonna try to go out there, you know what I'm saying, they're gonna get locked the hell up or you're gonna get deleted. <laughs> when the Lord, when the Lord sent down that, that, that word, you know what I'm saying, no more street teaching. Yep. You know what it is, yo. Let's go to the next phase. Yep. It's time yep. for the next phase, man. Turn it yep. that's, why we, that's why we gotta be doing the right thing and, and, and to that, leading up to that day. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So when that day, you know what I'm saying, come, you know what I'm saying, you can you know saying, approach it with confidence in the Lord, you know what I'm saying? Right. Knowing you did the right thing, you know what I'm saying? Right. You want to approach that day, you know what I'm saying? No, you be bullshit. Hell and that, you're going to fail in the word now. Damn it, man. Can't get fed, you know what I'm saying? With the, this is the only thing that's keeping us stable right. anyway. Right. That's like right. Shopper was saying, somebody, you know what I'm saying, call his number, what have you. What's keeping us stable when shit like that happen? The knowledge. Yeah. So, Ninja, you can do whatever you want to. I'm stable with the knowledge. Right. So, whatever's going to happen is meant to happen. I can't right. stop shit. Right. Right. I put my faith in the Lord, you know what I'm saying? Whatever happens is meant to happen, man. Right. Yeah. That's but like right. the Lord said, but woe unto them of whom the offenses come from, though. Because right, right. people going to get offended, but woe unto them um, of whom them um, offended. You know what I'm yep. saying? Just probably paraphrasing. Yeah. Right. Plus the Lord said, you know what I'm saying? You touch one of my people, you know what I'm saying? Sure, you've been better off, you know what I'm saying? Jumping into a sea with a millstone yep. around your neck, man. You'd have been right. better off just deleting yourself instead of coming up against one of my servants. Yep. Yeah. The scriptures go to that, too. How the, uh, I, um, a dude, you know what I'm saying, sent somebody and they deleted his son and all that. Oh yeah, the, the, the leader's son. Yeah, yeah you know what I'm saying. That, that, the, yeah, the man who sent his son. But first he sent the oh, messenger. Yeah. yeah. Then he sent his son. Yeah. yeah. They're like, he was like, yeah. surely he's not. They're not gonna delete my son. Right. You know yeah. what I'm saying? They deleted his son. Yep. You motherfuckers had hell to pay, though, yep. right? So anybody, you remember the Lord said, you um, if I touch one of you, you know what I'm saying? Yep. You got hell to pay. Pretty much. Paraphrase. Right. Y'all got it. Uh, second, second edge seven and twenty-one again says, "For the heavenly Father have given straight commandment to such as Cain." what they should do to live, even as they came, and what they should observe to avoid punishment. So what you should observe, meaning keep to avoid punishment. So these straight commandments are so for our good, our, our, our well-doing, our, our benefit, our protection, right? You got it. Uh, 22, it says, nevertheless, they were not obedient yep. unto him. Yep, so they were disobedient. You know, you have much with majority of my people you see doing now. They're like, man, nah, man. I like, I like, I like doing this. I'm up right now. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm trying to get this bag, or you know, shit. I'm Whatever good. Jake into, man. I'm all, all the way up. I'm all the way up. I'm untouchable. That's the mentality of Jake. Mm -hmm. it says, mm -hmm. got it. It says, but spake against him, and imagine vain things. Spoke against him, man. Nah, I ain't with that Hebrew Israelite stuff, man. What did, uh, what did that dude, Tarzan White, say? He said, I'm a uh, I'm yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, yeah, I'm a nigga. I'm, I'm black. I ain't know yeah, he's yeah. like. Yeah. And some of the stuff he say is, is, is on point, but overall, nah. he's just a ninja. Yeah. He's just a ninja who, right. who's out there performing. Uh, well, he ain't nothing but a plant anyway. Right. Say it again. Well, he ain't nothing but a plant anyway. Yep. Yeah. Moe just come out of nowhere and saying, get all this fame. You're on, you on every damn TV show. Right. You're getting all these interviews. Moe would be just another distraction. Yep. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Yep. Cause you made some good points or whatever but he just set up. Yep. Cause remember he was a geek at one time. Mm -hmm. I'm saying he was a geek pushing the um uh, the message as a geek. Yep. He said he said he had to turn into um a thug. A you know what I'm saying? Yep. Yes, he had to come in the alter ego right. just to get our people attention. Yep. You know what I'm saying? 
He said, because when he was preaching the same thing he preaching now, no saying or teaching or whatever, no saying when he was like a nerd, yep. you no know saying yep. Warren Dexter type shit, you no know saying nobody won't listen to him. But then when he came out, like bitch, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> that's when everybody started listening to him and all that, you no know saying. But that's what our people want. They want the thug. Yep. They listen to the thug. You no know saying. You got it. Verse 23 is. Bring out a couple more scriptures and then we'll wrap it up. It says, and deceive themselves by their wicked deeds. Well, we read whatever a rod won't know say, but most of it, if y'all could bring out second Hebrews, the ninth chapter, one to add a little bit. Started probably what, nine? Yeah. Ain't that it, y'all? Yeah, I think it's nine. Yep. Yeah. Verse 23 says, and deceive themselves by their wicked deeds. Yep. And said of the Most High that he is not. Mm. Yeah, yeah, they don't believe in the Lord. You know, they got that same mentality as, as uh, Esau. The Lord don't see me. You are the fa your father the devil. The same mentality. You've been doing it for so long, you don't think the Lord's going to destroy your ass. You know that, but that's a prideful mentality. You don't think you, you think you're untouchable. You got it. Oh yeah, now you got no saying all the Israelite group. That that I U I C right away. We don't never see no motherfuckers. At all. You know what I'm saying? At all. We seen them. We seen them. Um, we seen them last week just stumping around the park when they was having the, um when all the people was getting on the bus <laughs> for that for that concert. What was it J Cole concert? Yeah, yeah, yeah. When all the people was getting on the bus, you know what I'm saying they, they was stumping around that little park. You know what I'm saying singing that nonsense. One attention. Uh, like like toy soldiers and shit. You don't never see these damn dudes. Right. Yo, when you see them, yo. You know what I'm saying? I think somebody said they seen them one time. You know what I'm saying? Um, right there with oh, the park, yeah. with the park come in at the uh, the driveway thing. Right. With that uh, big thing where we park at and shit. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Uh, the, the restaurant is like right here, like the driveway shit, they go into the uh, parking deck thing. Yeah, yeah. And that little restaurant, they were like kind of like right there. You know what I'm okay. saying? Handing out flyers. Yeah, handing out flyers yeah. and shit. Not saying shit. You know what I'm saying? They 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 teaching them saying that a man um only supposed to have one wife. And they're teaching them saying if your um woman as it came into the truth um in um in a year, no saying you're supposed to no saying um get rid of these niggas, man, that ain't nothing about fraternity cats, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, real talk. You know what I'm saying? Real talk. With fucking uh with um with um dreads and shit like that. Yeah, yeah. Shape ups and all this shit, bro. Walking around snubbing, y'all. Snubbing the yard. No about fucking nobody's man. Right. Sell out show five hundred one C three guys, you know what I'm yeah. saying? That ain't the real deal, man. Right. Walk around, I'm, I'm, everybody over here ain't got to have on purple. Yo, right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> or blue, or right. green, or whatever, yo. Everybody got their own spirits, yo. Right. My woman know how to make garments, but I got to get I get a garment from your wife. You know what I'm saying? And I got to pay for this shit. Right. Them niggas making hell of money, yo. Everybody yeah. got to buy the garment that they, they, they making shit, right? And then you don't get a garment when you first come in. You get a shirt. You know what I'm saying? You got to work your way up to what you're wearing a garment. You know what I'm saying? You got you to gotta work your way up to wearing a garment, yo. You know what I'm saying? Right. When you first come in, you mean me like, I got to wear a shirt first. Right. I got to wear a shirt with friends first. You know what I'm saying? Right. So I get up in the system rank, right. and then I get to put a garment on once I've been right. in it for a couple of years. Where that at in the Bible? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. You just you just call me brother, yo. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 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 When I, when, before I even came to the truth, when I knew of like the color, the true color of the, you know, Moya House Shop, yeah. my first time meeting at CIU, yeah. I was outside of the Call group. them whatever you want to call them, you know what I'm saying? The purple guys. Yeah, the yeah, 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 yeah. When I met the Dagos yeah. group, yeah. they was outside working out. That's not flying. You seen them before you seen us? Yeah. And they, they came with me and was like, you know, they came to the college. I'm going to get to that See? part next. And they was like giving out flies. I got a fly. I went, I already know what you're talking about, man. Yeah. We're going to wait. Next time I see them, homecoming, they outside. They're college. They're See what I'm saying? Preaching to a bunch of niggas. They ain't even trying to hear them. No. Out here screaming. Everybody having a good time. They ain't trying to hear y'all, man. No, no. Just getting footage. They just getting footage to put oh, them. Yeah, yeah, on this video. Slice and dice. Tussle, 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 tussle. IUIC shuts down Shaw University's homecoming. Right, 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 right. IUIC shuts down Dayton, Ohio's Reeds Bags. IUIC shuts down Dayton, Ohio's Reeds Bags. Right, right, right. IUIC shuts down Dayton, Ohio's Reeds Bags. 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 IUIC you teach them true, then you throw a lie in there, guess what? You might want well to take the whole scrapbook, yep. ball it up, throw yep. it in the trash, and start again. Yep. But they ain't going to do that, though, because they're too far in there. No, yep. they're in too deep. It's like that damn movie, in too deep. Yep, yep, in They're in too damn deep, yo. They lead it anyway. That's why That's why they lead it. Don't say nothing when they go off on yep. some shit. Right. Right. It tell yep. you it tell you that a bishop, you know what I'm saying, should only have one wife just because of his position. Yep. You know what I'm saying? He got a lot to deal with, yep. you know what I'm saying? He, he too involved in the ministry. Yep. Plus the a woman is a distraction, you know what I'm saying? But it doesn't say he, 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 he should only 
only have one woman. Right. You know what I'm saying? The Apostle Paul was giving him sound advice. Right. You know what I'm saying? Having, having like, one woman is enough. In this right. Country, was, we're trying to have two or three. Right. Shit, man. Your time is already limited. You know what I'm saying? With the ministry, you know what I'm saying? Right. So that's basically what that's going into. Yep. You can't just keep going around telling telling men that they only can have one woman. Right. When the scriptures don't you know saying don't um advise that, you know right. what I'm saying? You can't keep doing that, man. Mm -hmm. Everything is lawful, but everything is not nice. speaking. Yeah. Yep. So you can have as many women as you want, you no know saying, but it's not wise. Right. It's time to have a whole lot of women. It's too time consuming. Right. And you ain't gonna be able to, you know, saying, get into the ministry, teach lessons, do lessons throughout the week if you got like um a hundred wives, you know what I'm right. saying, right. on this side. <laughs> Plus, you got to have that money and all that, too, to take care right. of that many women, yo. You got to provide for them and shit, house them, yeah. things of that nature. Okay, ain't no pump and dump shit, you right. know what I'm saying? Right. That's what all the women want, though. All the women want is pump and dump. You got it, bro. That's why I say it's those that be married care for the thing. And you do got brothers that can balance that, you know what I'm saying? But the scriptures go to how, like, a man that has a wife, you know what I'm saying, care more about, you know what I'm saying? And once yep. again, it's strapping because some men can still have a wife and still get that word and they're yep. on fire, you know what I'm saying? Right. But That's the majority of our people, you know what I'm saying, they get a woman, you know what I'm saying, they care about what the woman right. care about. She of the world, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Gotta go on this dinner date, gotta go to mom's house, right. gotta go to dad's house, right. gotta take this vacation, gotta go here, gotta go there, you know what I'm saying? Gotta cater to her, right. gotta worry about her damn feelings. Right. I don't know what's wrong with your dad. Right. Right. Something is wrong. <laughs> no, it ain't no hate. Going through that shit. But a man that's unmarried, you know what I'm saying? Care about how you can please the Lord. That's right. That's the point right. we make. But you can't just be going around telling people that they can't do certain things when it ain't biblical, man. Right. Add to the scriptures, man. That's right. I'm going to pay for that shit so it come to, though, man. Yeah. So they're using Apostle Paul to say that, right? Yeah. But he also said that a uh, man shouldn't have long hair. Yeah. Right. Or yeah. shape up. Or shape up. Right. Like that. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, oh, and, and, and the Apostle Paul also said, you know what I'm saying, that you don't supposed to worship no other God. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Which would you go? But, but, but what they say, they say, he just was saying that for the church. Yeah, yeah. He wasn't saying, saying that for the rest of the church. That's what I'm saying, bro. When, when you go in, when you go into, um, you went to 1 Corinthians, the 1 Corinthians, the third chapter, all scriptures is for inspiration, yep. for yep. proof. It didn't just say no sin for that church, it meant right. for all the churches. You know what I'm saying? Right. But that's just another one of their gifts to get money. Yep. It's all about money, man. Yep. I wish I, I wish a ninja would. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. It's just too much, though, bro. Instead of having a family assembly, man. He ran down the hall. He ran down the hall with the cameras behind him, like yep. in the movie. Yeah. Yeah. It was a dark. It was a dark video too. <laughs> hey, look, you know, say, look, look, if I got a woman, woman ain't screaming hollering for no man. Guy, man. Right. I don't play that shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Nah, uh, yo. Showing another man more attention than you've been showing me, yo. You're supposed to be screaming and hollering for me, if anything. Right. Not nobody else. Right. Ain't nothing wrong with right. you saying shalom to a brother or whatever. If you, if, if you even meet a brother. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, if you even meet a brother. You know what I'm right. saying? Right. That's, that's going to be um, fucking um, um, unlikely, so to speak. Right. Highly unlikely. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because brothers going to be wanting to meet each other yeah, women no. and shit. But if you right. happen to meet a brother, shalom, and that's it. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's right. That's probably be the last time you meet my brother anyway, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> probably that one time. That's right. Certain occasions, so to speak, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. But yeah, our women ain't gonna be just doing all this screaming and all this for another man, though, you know what I'm saying? That's all the shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's like, that's why, that's why, let your, let your woman learn at home and sons. Yep. As the scriptures have said, if your woman learn anything, um, let her learn at home from her husband, yo. That makes sense now. The fuck, yo. See why it makes sense now, right? And they also say, don't turn around your brother's uh, wife unless you fall for it. I mean, certain occasions you might see your brother's woman or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But then it's going to be like some fucking, fucking on the go type yeah, shit, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Yep. A brother's wife might drop him off at your house or some shit like right. that, some shit like that, you know what I mean? She might come pick him up or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, all right, sis, yep. some shit like that, you know what I'm saying? Ain't going to be no group of us, you know what I'm saying, with all our wives and shit, you know what I'm saying? Right. Just hanging around, right. we in one room, then all the women. Right. Room. No, we ain't playing nothing like that, man. You see? That's right. Clear, bro. You got it, bro? Go. Uh, go back to that. Thank you. They haven't been open. He said yes. All right. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Have a blessed day. You too. too. Thank you. Yep. You got, you got it. Yeah. You work at the same place. Get it. Get it. Get it uh, yeah. yeah. They having an open house. You know what I'm saying? Look, the Lord always blesses them. Uh -huh. You want to play? Yeah. You want to play? Huh? You want to play? You came straight. 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 Came
Oh, I, I thought she. This well, should come to you or me? This should come to you or me? Came to me first. Yeah, oh, yeah, so that's you you want to take it? No. Nah, yeah, nah. <laughs> she going to the bed. Uh, I don't know what I'm about, so he claimed he's straight to the floor. <laughs> <laughs> done, you know? I put on the table. Put on the table. Your shoes was pleasant. She was pleasant, though, huh? I know, she was. Yeah, she was. I know, right? I know, right? She was like, she was going to cry. I know, right? Please, please. You know what I'm saying? I think you're trying. No, you can tell she was on some old. Yeah, yeah. She ain't calling him his dad. Yeah, y'all do not know. Hey, you want to meet them? Somebody going to get him. He knows something. Somebody going to get him, right? Somebody. He said, I'm full. He told me he was full. And them shit's right there because them shit's expensive, too. Yeah, they are. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, go ahead. Homie. Got it, bro. Let's go ahead. The Lord, no, saying the Lord gonna cause our enemies to treat us well. Though. That's a fact. That's just the Lord showing us that our enemies is gonna cause our enemies to treat us well. It's gonna be people coming out of the cut just like that, bro. Yep. No, saying catering to us, bro. Bless him, man. So we ain't gotta stress nothing. Yep. The Lord take us to find all I need. We ain't gotta stress uh, shit, bro. Right. The Lord take care of us for real, for real, uh, man. Yep. Hell, man. She just came out of nowhere. She came out of that building right there. She said, no she said, um, uh, yeah. She said, she said we having a, um, a function or whatever. You know, oh yeah, she said we having a banquet. You know what I'm saying? Wow. She's like, nobody's gonna eat this. She was, she had a pleasant voice though. Yeah, she you know? did. That's a voice you don't mind waking up to. Right. She, she ain't coming with that Keisha shit. I know, right? That ghetto shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> fucking, fucking damn voice. Yeah. Like, yeah. Fucking smoking cigarettes. I ain't know what she want. I seen her coming over here. Why well, I thought she gonna go? You know what I'm saying? Keep going, right. y'all. Please the Lord, he make his enemy to be at peace with him. She was a nice arm, uh, Karen. Uh, uh, she invites you to her house, don't say that everything be all love, yep. love. You ain't got to worry yep. about that. Yep. She's taking real good care of you, bro. Uh, yeah, that should go right in. You don't know nothing there. She look all right, though, bro. Go ahead. <laughs> well, look, she won't afraid of us. Right. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead, bro. Bring out what you got. Yeah. Remember, uh, like two. Uh, did you did you ever get um did y'all get second edge of the ninth chapter? No, we're about to get it. Yeah, right. right. Um, you got a preset right quick. Yeah. Okay. yeah, yeah bring right. yours and then we'll go to second edge. Yeah. yeah. Um, this is um Deuteronomy chapter four. Plus we like a uh, we like a uh, like a my mind uh, my mind. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Uh, what you call that shit? The, um, to be standing here. Statue. Not, not a statue, but all the other shit. Uh, Too. It's something I can't think of right about now. Lighthouse? They're all them names y'all name, but it's something I can't think of. You know what I'm but anyway, you know what I'm saying? We like um when you go through the city and see see something like just be there. Oh, we like we like yeah. that shit. I can't think like of it. Landmark. Man. Yeah. landmark. Yeah, we like a landmark yeah, in the city, yeah, yeah. bro. You know what I'm saying? Nobody yep. don't fuck with us, they used to fuck with us. Yeah. They don't fuck with us right. no more, you know what I'm saying? Because they know the only thing we out here doing is just preaching the word, you know what I'm saying? Yep. So she keeps staring over here. But bring, bring it out over bro. This um, Deuteronomy 4 and 5 in a Good News translation. I have taught you all the laws mm -hmm. as the law of my power told me to do. Obey them in the land that you are about to invade and occupy. Ooh. Ooh. Obey them faithfully and this will show the people of the other nations how wise you are. Yep. When they hear of all these laws, they will say what wisdom and understanding this great nation has. And then we get back to that, you know? Mm -hmm. And then when the uh, kingdom of heaven is established, these, these nations are going to be bringing their goods to us at the gates. Bringing, like, what? There ain't no nation like this wise and, and great nation. We're getting back to that, man. Right. Look, 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 we're going to give them to somebody. Yeah. Don't just sit them there because somebody yeah. might throw them away. Yeah. They might think that nobody. Yeah, yeah, get them right quick. We'll give them to somebody. I, I we'll actually hand it to somebody. Yeah. To add on that scripture, King Solomon is a prime mm -hmm. example of. He getting them down. Look, he getting them down. No, no, no. Nice enough to give them. Yeah, but he was nice enough to give them. Yeah, no, so we don't give them, you know what I mean? We'll give we'll give them to somebody before we leave this area. You got something you were saying something though? One of y'all was saying something? No, I was I was saying that the verse you brought out is similar to when King Solomon was ruling yep. earth. How everybody was coming to Jerusalem. Yep. It was a praise in the whole world. Yep. 
That's right. Everybody from all the four corners of the world was coming, bringing gifts, yep. trying to inquire about how yep. we, how righteous we are. Motherfuckers heavy too. Look, look, look at it cost, it cost what you were saying, your point. This is 7, 4, and 7 in the Good News Translation, Deuteronomy 4 and 7. No other nation, no matter how great, has a power who is so near when they need him as the Lord our power is to us. He answers us whenever we call for help. Ooh. Hey. Speak on it, bro. Hey, I just said that like he was saying, we're going to be restored. And once we restored and we calling on the true names, going back to the Judith, the fifth chapter, yeah. you know, nobody going to be able to touch us. Right. right. We ain't going to have to worry about nothing. That's we right. according to his promise, look for a new kingdom when in dwell of righteousness. righteousness. Right. Then we're gonna be perfect too. Perfect. Yeah. When we what? come into these, um, when we go to like um, wherever these, um, I know a brother was doing a lesson um, yesterday. Uh, oh yeah, the, um, the other Kazakh, um, the Allah, you know what I'm saying? When Mississippi was going into like, like right about now, we gotta like plan what we're gonna do and shit. Yeah. And that day, you know what I'm saying? When we go, we just decide what we're gonna go in and jump up or down. Yeah, you know yeah, yeah. And these heathens gonna know, you know what I'm saying, that we on our way and shit, you know what I'm saying? Well, well, before we get there, we're gonna be bowing down all yeah. that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's gonna be like an honor for us to, to visit them. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Like such and such came to your house, King. Yeah, such and yeah. such. <laughs> right, right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They you know saying came. Malak, such and such came to your crib. Right, 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 right. 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 And they and they gonna um get. You know what I'm saying? Like um a good um what's the word? A good uh, report. Yeah. yeah. They gonna get a good report. You know what I'm saying? Like words, yo. What, what they say, yo? What did they say? Yo? <laughs> you know they're gonna treat the under men a little well. Yep. It might be you, one of your wives, or maybe your sons or your daughter, or whatever. Visit, visit their town or they visit the have the Lord has it set up, you know what I'm saying? And you know they're going to go all out because they want yeah. their good report, man. We're going to be ruling the earth. Who doesn't want, just like when these different heathens come from wherever they come from, they come to a city or whatever, they get the greeting, they get the, uh, the treatment, the red carpet treatment, man. Yep. Why? Because everybody want a good report, you know what I'm yep. saying? Of how they, how they, how they treated, you know what I'm saying? How these people treated, you know what I'm saying? The, the hierarchy, yep. you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Right. And you get a reward from the hierarchy, you know what I'm yep. saying? Based on how good, well, you treated the people, you know what I'm saying? That's, that's right. how these teasers are going to be, yo. When the Lord put us back in authority, man. So everywhere we go, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be a red carpet, you know what I'm saying? Laid out, so to speak, uh -huh. man. Gifts and all that, yo. Music. Right. Music, yeah. Yep. Yep. Oh, oh, yeah. And then, then people, you know what I'm saying, already hearing about you, you know what I'm saying? People have been studying yep. you. Yep. There's going to be books written about the men of the Lord, yep. you know what I'm saying? So people going to already know what you like and things of that nature, you know what I'm saying? So people going to already have it. If your favorite uh, fruit is grapes, you can do big time, big things. Right. The grapes going to be there, you know what I'm saying? The most um, luscious grapes. Right, right, it's going right. to be grape um, um, juice, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I mean, grapes, grape juice, or whatever, man. Well, that's only right once a year. Yeah. <laughs> the be the uh -huh. best of the best, you know what I'm saying? Mangoes. The best of everything they got, you know what I'm saying? Mangoes, whatever the brothers like. Say they know what type of women you like. You know it's gonna be some virgins that waiting on you. You gonna leave with some extra wives. Hell yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Good nice clean, clean girl. good clean, clean girls. Girl. And, it, and it's just true. It's just true. You got it, bro. Yeah, that was a beautiful scripture, though, bro. <laughs> yeah, good news go hard. Yo, good, good, yeah, yeah. Especially yeah. the first one when you brought the first one was Ecclesiastes. The first one about this is um, knowledgeable people. Oh, oh that's Deuteronomy. Deuteronomy. Yeah, that was Deuteronomy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I always forget what that said. And I bought that at the. Um, Goodwill um, for a dollar. Wow. Right. But then, but then the other is like, they sell them Bibles, you know what I'm saying? For lots of money. You know what I'm saying, bro? She, you walk into a, um, um, uh, a store that you use a Bible in there, they give you the Bible for free. Yeah. I didn't walk into a certain store, they give you the Bible for free. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. Yeah, and it's crazy to say, on this corner, I think right up there, it's a little yeah. church that they give away. Yeah, they give away free Bibles, Bibles yeah. Free. Yeah. Wow. It's a spirit, man. We ain't charging nobody for no Bible. We ain't charging nobody for no Hebrew name. We ain't charging nobody for no Bible. We ain't charging nobody for prayer to pray for you. No, man. That's I don't even look even doing that, though, bro. That shit don't even look right. You don't even feel right doing that, Joe. Especially, especially, especially when you fuck around and take the money. It's not like you joking or whatever. Somebody here you to give you the money. You're like, nah, bro. I'm just playing. Cool. But if you take that money, you know how bad you're going to feel later on, you know what I'm saying, that evening, yo. You just took somebody money, yo. Right. Nah, yo. Fuck all that, man. You got it, bro. Says charity comes Much to the same. Yep. You always you use every damn time somebody see you just take, take, take. You ain't giving, you ain't gave nobody nothing for free. Right. You just take, 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 take. You got it, bro. Yeah. 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 It's uh, Isaiah two and two. It says, and 
and it shall come to pass in the last days that the mountain of the Lord's house shall be established in the top of the mountains. That government, that represents government. Yeah. Shall be established on top of the mountain, the, the world, basically. Yeah. And there's no, it's not going to be any other mountain. Yeah. It's going to be one government. Yeah. No, right. it's the new world, the new one world order. Mm -hmm. It's about to be established forever. The real world. The real, the real world. world order. <laughs> right. Dictatorship. Dictatorship. There ain't gonna be no one. I think they should do this. No, right, motherfucker. Right. One way and one way only. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Lord coming back as a dictator. That's you know what I'm right. saying? It's either his way or no way. That's right. All the way. Right. I know, right? Congress over yeah, here. You got the Senate, the Congress. Yeah. You got Voting and all this shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, folks gonna vote today. Right. <laughs> no, there's gonna be no voting shit, yo. Y'all got it. it. says, and shall be exalted above the hills. Yep. And all nations shall flow unto it. Yep. yep. Right. You speak on it, bro. Top yeah. government is wise, you know what I'm saying? Yep, just bagging on what the you know elder was saying. Yep. Like all these other nations gonna be coming up to the nation of Israel, yep. man. Bringing us all their goods. Good, yep. Trying to like run of our ways. Yep. Right. So we gotta teach these heathen, yep. you know what I'm saying? Right. Keep them the priests. Yep. Yeah. And we're gonna be Roy and Regal. Because remember, you know what I'm saying, uh, when uh, Queen of Sheba, you know what I'm saying, which King Solomon never had sex with her. Right. The Queen of Sheba, you know what I'm saying, came, you know what I'm saying, to see King Solomon. Right. She thought the doorman <laughs> was the king. Right. You know what I'm saying? She thought the good, she thought the doorman was nope. the king. Nope. You can tell brother been using his swords, right? I know, right? She thought the doorman was the king. So imagine, you know what I'm saying, when the Lord set up his priest right. upon the face of the earth. You know what I'm saying? Right. Even the, the resources that are managed is going to be managed to perfection. Mm -hmm. You're not going to have manholes in the in the street. I know, right? holes I know, right, bro? Power lines running over the dang, yeah. the damn city. Right, right. chemtrail. Right. It's going to be ran to perfection, like you was mentioning earlier about the order being set up. You know, some some of us very well could have been you know part of the elect that was uh, helping create things. Mm -hmm. You know, in the beginning, at first fruits. So of course, every lightning and all that. Yeah. everything was created, man. Yep. Yeah. Right. So of course. Those men who are back here today, Lord, when we were part of that number, know how to manage the earth yeah. <laughs> that they help create. So order is being set up to perfection. These, these other nations are going to marvel when they see we must rule, man. Mm -hmm. They're going to marvel, man. Yeah. It's hard when the wicked and the authority the people want is when the white people want. They're ready to rejoice. Yep. Yep. Everybody's going to get a fair shake. Yep. yep. Water's going to be clean again. You know what right. Saying? Yeah. Ain't going to be no other heathen nation invading another uh, heathen nation. Right. Now, man. Shit going to be in order, man. Yep. And these heathens going to go from time to time because they got to get judged. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they got to have some fun with them. You know what I'm saying? Right, but, you right. know. I know, right? They commit a wicked act. You know what I'm saying? We're going to hear about it. You know what I'm right. saying? You know, come lay down the law. You know right. what I'm saying? Yeah. It depends on what that law that you broke. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? The penalty for it, whatever. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? If it's deletion, right. deletion. Right. They ain't know you sit somewhere for nine months. You know right. what I'm saying? Maybe a year and all that to your court date. <laughs> Jeremy be executed. So when we come into town, you know what I'm saying? How the Lord set it up. So when we come into town, you know what I'm saying? What, what do you do? I you know, commit right? adultery? You already know what that is. Well, that's right. off with you. That's stone or you the uh, flamed up, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. You know, <laughs> you got it, bro. You got to take it to the gate of the city. Uh -huh. I said, if the little one acting bad, he wanted to correct me. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here it goes. Go ahead, man. I know, right? You got me. It's weird, right, man? He'll be back in the mind so he'll come down. Go ahead, bro. The second edge of chapter 9, verse 9 says, Then shall they be in a pitiful case, which now have abused my ways, Yo. and they that have cast them away despitefully shall dwell in torments. Yeah, those of our people who didn't take heed, you know, uh, was, was too invested in the world, and then now the world is, is, is going down. Damn. They're going down with it. They abuse the ways of the Lord. Well, like, they, a damn, like a damn airplane. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> <laughs> you got it, bro. Yeah, so now this place is coming to an end. You know, you still got our people holding on, thinking that it's going to bounce back. The Lord said, nah, you abused the ways. You didn't want to take heed to my promise. You didn't want to get in order. All right? Because you had some freedom. That you thought you had some freedom, you know, to, to do whatever you wanted and, think, and thought that the world was the side to choose. Wrong side. Yeah. But so. you had all the time in the world to jump around and do a shit. Right. Daddy, daddy, oh, daddy, the walls are closing in, so to speak. Yeah. Somebody's birthday or something. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Something going on. Something going on. They got all nine. <laughs> See, women like that, women like that, Jake Hopped up with some bad women, but they ain't going to be compared. They're to our women. Right. They are gorgeous. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But they ain't going to be nothing. Come on, man. You think, what you think the Lord going to hook this man up I know, with, right? Man? Come on, it's a child's play compared to what the... Oh, man, that's all. That women ain't going to be proud. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
caught up with a long ass limo. Come on, man, we're gonna, Jake, we're gonna pull up in a spaceship, yo. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Y'all pull up in a limo, Jake gonna pull up in a spaceship. You know what I'm saying? Right. This decked out for referee in the inside. Yeah, go ahead. We ain't went on there and check the suit season, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I know, right? Come out there, you know what I'm saying? We, with the agent dogs on Free Street Rose. That's right. Yeah. You know, them, you know them outfits gonna be decked out, too. Hell, you know? yo. It's gonna be the, uh, the final of everything, final of silk. We're right. gonna all silk. Yep. All cotton. I know, right? Whatever linen it is, all such and such. You know what I'm saying? Right. That, that outfit gonna be made with that one fabric. You know what I'm yep. saying? Every outfit. We got, we got, we got um, um, fabric shops and all that, man. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. With people just making us clothes, y'all. Yep. It's gonna be like, it's gonna be like um, coming to America and all that, y'all. Yeah. You ain't wearing the same thing. Yep. You know what I'm saying, bro? Come all on, right. King wearing the same thing. It ain't happening, bro. It ain't only thing is gonna be the same that we wear with that crown. You know what I'm saying? Right. Lord willing, we get it. You know what I'm saying? That's the only thing. You know what I'm saying? But anything else, man? Come on, man. Anything else civilized? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, right. 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 Cause King Solomon, you know what I'm saying? He was so rich, you know what I'm saying? Remember, a flight, you know what I'm saying? How the civil, yeah. either the gold school, yeah. it was like, you know what I'm saying, bro? <laughs> <laughs> right, right. That's how much abundance of gold right. you had, man. Right. Bring me another one. Nothing, yeah, you know what I'm saying, bro? Right. 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 bro. Chop, chop. You know what I'm saying? Right. <laughs> we don't have to stress nothing, man. Like so, right. you know, right. And everything that we speak of is, is going to happen. That's right. Right. So it doesn't matter, man. You ain't got to believe everything that we read about is going to happen. You got it, bro. Verse 10, it says, for such as in that life have received benefits and have not known me yep yeah benefits bond the eyes of, uh, of our people yep. you know they got a whether it be a job they got you know some money the new thing now is uh, uh biden's supposed to be clearing out some of these oh, uh, yeah, student yeah, debt. Student, student, and it's yeah. actually happening for some people what jake gonna do use that i got yeah. extra money they gonna try to vote for him again. vote for him again that's it try to vote for him again they're gonna be more invested in the world because he knows it's time for election let me uh, help somebody. Yeah, let me at least have about a thousand. Right. I'm not gonna have the the, uh, the, the forty million. Right. You know what I'm, saying? I'm gonna have a thousand though. Yep. I gotta make a I gotta make I gotta make a mark right there. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah. Right. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, I think so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I see. They haven't done that a couple of days ago. Uh, yeah, yeah. And it's like, uh, that temptation song, like, the girl's all right with me. It's like, they get violence all right with me. You know violence all right. It's called the streets of Joseph. Yep. It's almost. It's going to stop you. You get the straw of the heart, too. Yep. You got it, bro. We'll finish off. Read a couple more verses down into that. Oh, yep. It says, uh, verse 11, Second verse 9 and 11 says, And they that have loathed my law while, uh -huh. while they had yet liberty, yep. and when as yet place of repentance yep. was opened unto them, yep. understood not. Yeah, so they uh, people had this time of repentance, this grace period to get right with the Lord. You know, they had the freedom and liberty to do so, but they loathed the law, meaning they hated the law, they hated righteousness, the ways of the Lord. They uh, misused the prophets, which is the Lord speaking to them. You know, they they decided they're gonna do their own thing. What's the last part? It says, it says, uh, place of repentance yep. was open unto them, understood not. They didn't understand how important this grace period is, how precious this time is. That's why the scripture say redeeming times, meaning when you read that NLT, it says making the most of this opportunity. Mm -hmm. This is the most precious time to really be seeking the Lord for real. Yep. For real. Lock in. Lock in. Right. Just like in the time of Noah, you know what I'm saying? They didn't understand that the doors of mercy was open like that door. Yep. You know what I'm saying? There, are, yep. there was mercy inside there. You know what I'm saying? Like walking, walking, walking through that doorway was mercy inside. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. People don't know, you know what I'm saying? Coming up, getting into this word, that's where mercy yep. lies. You know Safe what I'm saying? Haven. Taking you to this word, that's where mercy, mercy lies, lies, man. Yep. Right. You see? Safe haven. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The animals was wise enough to get into it. Well, the animals well, just yeah, followed the, the, the water. The, 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 yeah, it was you know just part of the movie. The animals just followed the water. Yeah, it was just part of the movie. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, just part of the yeah, the animal just yeah. following the order, you know what I'm saying? Order, That's yeah. all. You got it. It says, but despised it. Mm -hmm. It says, the same must know it after death by pain. So the Lord is has, has a uh, has a uh, reserve every two-third Israelite who didn't take heed to the message for a deletion. Mm -hmm. They're going to know it by pain. They're going to know. They're going to experience that that death by pain. All right, they're they, they going to have to, it's going to hurt, basically. Mm -hmm. And that, one thing that I think about is a nuclear destruction. No, the Lord's gonna sit them, let them feel that fire, that burn, yeah. man. 
You know, and all, all because, other plays and stuff that's coming though, like cannibalism yep. and stuff like that. Yep. It's gonna be a painful um, um, situation right there, yo. Yep. Somebody asked for eating you and shit, bro. Yep. Let's say from like your feet. They yep. ain't gonna start your head because the Lord gonna want you to feel it, yo. He yep. wanna know. He gonna. Uh, he, want, he want you to know that you're the effed up. Yep. Yep. Hey, I'm gonna say this too about me. I saw the movie Civil War. It came out. You see, I got mixed reviews about it. I'm not going. Yeah. I'm not even going. I ain't gonna support it. Ain't seen it yet. But I'll, I'll say this. You know, they had some good parts, man. It's like, yo, it's about to get real out here, man. It's gonna get real out here very soon. A lot of people like going to the plagues, cannibalism, you know, famine and um, um sword. That yeah. war that's coming, you know? Yeah. Hey, look, in that day, Esau's not gonna have to hide who he is. He ain't gotta work with you know, yeah. there ain't gonna be no job where he gotta front act like you know. No, he's gonna let you know you were N-word to him. Yeah. You know, and he's gonna be walking around with his Draco, with yeah, his no, his yeah. weapons. Yeah. So, you wanna say something? Yeah, I was gonna say like uh, when, when our people end up in these these uh, these camps, man. Yep. You know, oh, yeah. they gonna be getting tortured. You know what I'm saying? Like, the Lord gonna have Esau doing whatever he wanna do with him. Right. That operation on warp speed. Yep. 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 You know what I'm saying? They just gonna rush in, they just gonna blitz out people. It's gonna be like yeah. some old Texas Chainsaw Massacre shit. Yeah. We having our people, you know what I'm saying, getting fucking put through that grinder. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. You're scared to get real, man. Damn. That's what people gonna be eating soon come, yo. Yep. The devil say, you no, know, say you take this implantable um device, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna give you some food. We're gonna be feeding you humans, man. Yep. You know what I'm yep. saying? Yep. Little, little, uh, fucking <laughs> animals and shit like that. <laughs> right. We're gonna be feeding you unlawful animals and shit like that. <laughs> Jamie blows that when they come downtown. They see some buildings for the first time. Even even their mama, man. But the Lord said, "No, say we're gonna be a um, gazing stock." Is that word? Uh, um, um, spectacle. Yeah. Yep. So when people see us, we 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 get it. Why they be looking all bugged out like they ain't never can they have it? You know what I'm saying? Right. The pencils be standing, them dudes standing on the corner with those dresses on, stay away from them. Yep. Stay the devil, the devil, you know what I'm saying? Oh, but he the main one up in the throat, like, Jesus saved, Jesus saved, and all this <laughs> You got it, bro. Uh, is, is there any more left to read? Yeah, I think it's some more in here. First, uh, Sacraments 9, 13 says, and therefore be, be thou not curious how the ungodly Ooh. shall be punished yep. and when. Yep. But inquire how the righteous shall be saved. Yeah, so we only worried about the hopeful elect. Yep. You know, we, we worry about the hopeful elect. We pray for the hopeful elect. We don't give a damn about two thirds. Right. It's all part of the movement. They Bone they phone chimed in. You know, they they already they already made it clear that they hate the Lord. Yeah. Right. By their actions and you know and the lack of respect. He sent forth. And the many he sent forth. You know. The only thing we were doing is reading the Bible. Right. We know these people hated our Lord. Mm -hmm. Yep. Say they, those that hate me love death. Yep. Mm -hmm. Hated them without a cause. Without a cause, bro. And then you know the scriptures say, um, send forth the, um, the, those deletion angels, yep. slay under the old and young, both maids, women, and yep. little children. Yep. So this shit gonna get real. And then the Lord said, when it start happening, don't pray for them. Don't pray for them. Hmm. Don't inquire about them. Let it be. You see them sitting, sitting somewhere stinking like hell? Yep. Starving? Don't pray for them. Yep. Send somewhere with their legs chopped off and all that right. shit. And then he have no saying getting out of the street because they come a big ass 18 wheeler truck. Right. Okay. <laughs> Keep it <going>. Oh, <laughs> do it like this. Black power. Black power. <laughs> right. Keep going, yo. What was the rest of that? He said, don't even bring up their name because I will not even hear. Yeah, mm. yeah. Mm. Yep. Woo. You got it, bro. It says. Finish this off and then wrap it up. Down it side. says. Whose the world is, that can't wreck a world. It says, from whom and and for whom the world is created. Yep. And at the end of the day, all said and done, Lord, the two thirds gonna come back in the kingdom. Yeah. They're gonna right. come back right through the elect. Through the elect. You know? Well, when we have that number. That's right. So, there you have it, man. So, we support and we embrace what the Lord is doing. Mm -hmm. We pray and encourage the Lord to continue to, to yep. ramp things up. Right. You know, we more we destruction. Much, yep, yep. It, that's more destruction. We right. in the beginning stages of Jacob's trouble now. Mm -hmm. We are here, man. Yep. So, hey, you want to say anything, bro? All right. Before we close out, we want to give all praises, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His Holy Begotten Son. Yahweh, 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 Double honor to the apostles. Bishops and elders, great millstone for teaching us the 100% truth according to the Bible. And who rule well, shalom to all you Akiam and you Aqua, those are the hopeful elect that are speak, uh, seeking for salvation. Shalom. 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 shalom.